five now. Oh, what's ow, going on? Ow, now, brown cow. <laughs> How's everybody doing? What's up? Bearded back Brits, again. Back uh, another Thursday. Yeah. We're up to like what? Twenty what? videos now, maybe. I don't, I don't know. know. It's uh, uh it, it, it they all run together. <laughs> this week, my man Mark's picking the set. Yeah, he, finally. Uh, it's not that we picked. Well, we it's, both your, just, it's your set. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's my set. Because I found it. Is this a... Uh, going to fit? No. No, no, no. It's not going <laughs> to fit. But, I mean, this is like your first like big play set. I don't have a play set at all. Yeah, some of the stuff is. Maybe the... I mean, I don't, I don't know what you consider a place. You can't even see me. <laughs> Put that over there. <laughs> I don't know. I actually had to take this apart, so I kind of cheated a little bit. I must put a laptop in the floor. <laughs> That'd be all right. You'd owe me a lot more than that Death Star. <laughs> nah. Now you see that right there? Right there. <laughs> you owe me, you, owe, I know you would need you... to buy another laptop and then get me one. See where it says new right there? Huh? Yeah, new. 900. <laughs> Retail. Not Retail. Best. <laughs> I know take what you paid off, for. Take it. that off. It's like Christmas, man. Take this off. You gotta hide this. <laughs> You're about to rip the cover with it. I know. I don't even remember what I paid for it. But I do. Two fifty. Yeah. Yeah. So good deal. But I had to pull it apart, so I got to see a lot of this stuff. I've not seen anything. So it's pretty cool. It's big. It is big. The it's ultimate. It's not as tall as that, but Lego Star Wars Collector Series. It's not. No. I'm to be the same size. No, it's nowhere near as tall. Well, can we take that apart and put that inside of it? That'd be cool. Wrong movie though. <laughs> so, uh, when at least whenever are I the, pulled it apart, are the bags numbered? Yes, I numbered oh, the bags. Okay. <laughs> yeah, we are gonna put this together dealing with his. <laughs> yeah, there might uh, be some separation skills. <laughs> there might be some issues, but <laughs> yeah. I like these big books. I do too. I'm gonna do this and I don't need to, but Oh god. And this set comes with a crap ton of minifigures. Yes it does. And I being the nice person found one. Uh actually put the minifigs where they go. Really? Good so back. we get to build them along with each step. Instead of some people I know that goes, oh, here's a minifix. Some of these steps are small. Like, look, eight. But then you get into, I want to say it's step five. There's two step five bags. Esta de la bad, few ek preva por Luke Skywalker, quien presentio su X-Wing hasta la superficie misa de la estrella de la muerte. What? Will you shut up? <laughs> I'm learning Spanish about Star Wars. Yeah, see, look at step five. <laughs> That's one step five. Actually, did it not make it into two? I thought there was. We might have problems. Uh-oh. They should all really be in here. <laughs> two I'm, and three. I'm not confident in his, or, uh, his separating skills. Man, you don't even really see this thing like start coming together until even step really seven. No, so you well, see how it. I guess the trash and everything, the compactor's done in step four. It's actually three done in four. three. Yeah, but it doesn't look complete. It's not. So I guess you build. You, you better have those. some. You better have some tiny fingers because there's actually string in this. You have to tie a knot in. We had to cut the end up. I I cut it off. I separated it that far out. Man. So. Well, Maybe five went all into one bag. I could have swore it went into two, but... The fact that you're not confident leads me to be not confident. <laughs> we probably ain't going to make it to five tonight. Just saying. <laughs> not with you building, we won't. Here. You're going to be the one that's on the phone all night, I have a feeling. <laughs> so... That's cool. What's his name? <laughs> uh, I don't remember. R2D7? Maybe. I like how you... Uh, is this the extra pieces? Yeah, that's, so this guy I bought them from... 
Oh, this shoots lasers too? Yeah. Oh, man. It's a playset. Yeah, but I don't like the laser shooting. Uh, the guy I bought it from, he actually, like, whenever he gave the thing to me, it was complete. And, you know, he handed me the box, the instructions. Uh, and then he had this little bag that had all the minifigs in it, all the extra pieces in it. And I'm like, oh, that's freaking awesome. So. It's not awesome. Freaking awesome. Freaking awesome. See, you put a lightsaber together. Look, you put Invader together. I'm just grabbing pieces. I got a random head. I'm pretty sure it's not. Vader don't have. No, nah, Vader's white head. Vader don't have lamb chops like that. I got white head. How are we doing this? Just go step to step, I guess. You do one, I do one. There's only one one. You do one, I do two. You do three, I do four. We need to get done by the end of the night. I wish we could build it that way. So Vader has this uh, cracked head? Huh? Yeah, white head. He's got cracks in the back of his head. Yeah, exactly. Crack head. He got busted. Well, shouldn't have been talking shit. Busted, Vader. Shouldn't have been talking shit. Did he really talk? I don't think he said anything. Yeah, he said, I'm your father. Yeah, but... He didn't like, what I'm saying is he didn't really talk crap. No, he backed it up. He did. <laughs> Man, I done broke the droid. Worth that. Wow, you pulled, that his, too. you pulled his legs off. I told you, man, disassembled. Man, we're going to be missing some pieces. Mike. <laughs> oh, Andy's, Andy's here, just so we know. Oh. Only thing we'll hear from him all night. Yeah. Well, at least he's watching. Give us the views. But is he watching or just letting it play? Well, either way. Man, what is he doing? Huh. There you go. You had him like... When did, droids, when did droids walk? This looks like an eBay version <laughs> of the ones that came with the Destroyer. Like, he just looks really cheaply made compared to that other one. But it looks the same. Made by the same company. I know that, but remember that's like ninety dollars. Yeah, I know. But... <laughs> uh oh, that'd be broke. Yeah, that's a lot more detail. <laughs> that's what I'm saying. They both look really upset. Well, you'd be upset too. Look at their faces. Does this this is the one from Yeah, from that's doing, the right? destroyer. Oh, he doesn't have a back side of his head. No. But he's got printing on each arm. To where the other one does. I bet that's why it's so expensive. Yeah, probably. That and the detail. His pants are printed too. Man, that's an extra. I wish my pants were printed. Invader couldn't finish off. I think he said Palpatine, but he did, he did, but it's just <laughs> Palestine. Palestine? <laughs> Correct one, Andy zero. Why don't you go ahead and take your step out and be sorting? sorting it? Yeah, that actually worked really good for us. Didn't I uh, already messed up. What'd you do? I didn't know Vader had a cape in there. Yeah, yeah there's instructions in front of you. Does Vader always have a cape? Uh, I don't know. Yes, I think so. Even when he sleeps. Well, is he in his uh, pajamas? Is he in his uniform or not? I don't know. If you were a Vader, would you wear your uniform to impress people? Yes. Would you? Yes. Would you not? What does a formal Vader look like? Got a little bow tie. <laughs> so he's not a full tie man. No, 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 he's bow tie. One of the houses we went and looked at the other night? Yeah. Um, of course, you know, somebody's living in it. We opened no. the uh, closet, yeah. and he had an entire rack. All the way across this closet, full of ties. Huh? I don't know what you do with the other guy. He's up there. He's over here. There you go. Um, I'm not even gonna attempt to put that back up from down here. Up, down, up, down, up. Tons of wing pieces in this. Oh, as they build the T 
how you make square look round. Square circles? Or circular squares? Uh, circular... Oh. <laughs> I already can't find pieces. Well, if you'd sort them a little better. Yeah, I probably should not. Tell you right now, pulling this apart was a job. You're going to have fun uh, doing your job tomorrow. What's my job tomorrow? Moving all that crap. So, yeah, I, yeah, I, mean, I thought you were trying to be smart and say something else. How many boxes you got to do? 130? 130. I don't even want to know what one box weighs. How many pieces are in a box? Only six. Oh, you're probably looking like five pounds a box. No. How long are they? Uh, there's 12 square foot in a box. Oh, so you're probably looking at maybe 20 pounds a box. Mm, that's probably high, but I, I would maybe 10-ish, 15-ish pounds a box. I'll just call out and come help. Yeah, I don't think that's gonna. I don't think that'll go over too well. You could, you know, what you could do. Say, I got the Rona. It might bite you in the ass, but you could answer that survey a little wrong, <laughs> <laughs> and then they call you and tell you you have to stay out. I didn't even do a survey this morning. Do you do that survey every morning? every morning? Yes. Oh, really? Yes, every morning. That's too much to do. No, it's not. How's it going, Blizzard? Life is up, Blizzard? Uh, okay, I guess. Now that North Carolina has opened back up. And we've seen our highest spike in numbers yet. See, you don't listen to nothing. What? You. What do you mean I don't listen to nothing? You don't listen to news. I don't listen to the news. No, that's, that's why I just said that. Are we really, like, up higher now? Oh, God, yes. Of cases? Oh, yes. Oh, so we're going to be shut that down soon. <laughs> I'm not sure how that's going to go. Like, why would they keep opening stuff up then? Well, that's what people are saying, but I mean, I don't know. Uh, there's a piece I, I can't find, but I'm just going to leave this. <laughs> what are you trying to find? The one by one tile with the print on it. Oh, I'm sure it's in there. Probably not. Well, you got to think, by the time we were pulling this apart, everything was already put up. I can't see whatever there. Okay, we'll pull the thing over to you. <laughs> oh, that's a heavy book. Whoa! There you go. Whoa! How's life going for you, Blizzard? Now that I found out through my news anchor, Mark, we're all gonna catch Corona soon. I thought the governor's idea was to open back up because we were doing so well. Uh, well, you know, well, I, I don't know. It's all a government conspiracy anyway. Yeah. No well, such thing as the corona. World's flat. It is. The uh, corona don't exist. We're all just sheep wearing masks. I'm getting oh. a little, I need to stop. Only smart people know that the world is flat. Yeah. Exactly. Gravity does not exist. No, but weight does. Yes. The uh, the only reason that things fall at the same time is because of density. No, it's weight. Remember. I thought he said it was density. No, that was Andy. Oh. Do me. Now he's gonna get hate mail. Good. <laughs> Two fat guys sitting in the world's flat. <laughs> <laughs> then there's going to be somebody that's like, y'all shouldn't call yourselves fat. You shouldn't degrade yourself like that. Eh, well. Call it how we see it. You just see what Mark does to himself. <laughs> <laughs> you know? <laughs> call it how we see it. Is that is that what we do? Uh, it is what it is. It is what it is. Sometimes it be like that. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Sometimes it really do be like that, though.
Mark has uh, still not joined the the TikTok. Nope. Holding strong. What if we were told we would get 10, 10 subscribers if you create a one? Man, I mean, 10? Eh. Nah. What? Nah. Why? Nah. Like you couldn't use another app on your phone? How many parts will be just to finish the build? So the one we're building, the Death Star 1, is 4,016 pieces. So it will not be finished. It, it's not going to be finished tonight. What? What? Nope, sorry. This is going to stretch a couple weeks. Probably three. And then when we're done, oh, Andy is going to come back on. And him and Mark are going to have their build off. Which means I got to buy something. I'll be the referee. What am I buying again? Oh, yeah, the. Uh... And it'll be a non Star Wars set for the first time in a little while. A little while. And if I was that piece, I'd be right there. Did you find it? Nope. I did oh, that. Good try. <laughs> I was trying to sneak up on it's it. It's right there. I already got it. Good. See, I told you. I was sneaking up on it. You ever seen a blaster with a silencer? Yeah. They're, they even make them any longer. Even longer, you take the. Oh, that's saber. a rifle. That's a rifle, man. Don't 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 degrade a silencer like that. What's the difference between a rifle and a blaster? One shoots energy. One shoots a bullet. And Duh. In Star Wars, there's no such thing as bullets. Exactly. That's why they're called blasters. So what's a really long blaster called? A sniper blaster. I don't think you're just making stuff up at this point. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. I think I'm right. The YouTube world agrees that Richard is always right. Mark <laughs> the is YouTube always wrong. world does not agree. Blizzard, don't you agree? Richard is always right. Mark is always wrong. What about you, Andy? We're going to get this in a vote. If I get five people tonight to say I'm always right and you're always wrong, I win. No, you don't. I win. In no, life. Don't. I can die a happy person. If this whole house process don't kill me first. <laughs> I'm glad I'm not like a stressed out person. Yeah. Because I, I, I feel like this is one of probably the most stressful things that you will go through. I don't like... It's not that it's stressful. Uh-huh. Hey, Lego Geek, what's going on? It's what's not up, that it, it's stressful. I think it's like... This is the way I'm picturing it in my mind. Uh -huh. All right, think about me having a really cool Lego set. Yeah. Me saying... Me saying... Or anything. Me saying, hey, do you want to see it? Because you like it. And you're saying, yeah. So I show it to you. I don't let you play with it. I just let you hold it. Uh-huh. You can hold it. You can move it. You can open it up, but you can't play with it. Uh -huh. Then I say, would you like to buy it from me? And you I'm not say, sure where you're going with this, but okay. And you say, yeah, I want to buy it from you. And I'm like, okay, well, I think the price is 150 What would you like to offer me for it? And then me telling you that there's somebody else interested in buying it too, but I can't tell you what they offer. So what do you do? Uh, Lego Geek, the extra, this isn't an extra one. This is actually Death Star 1, not 2. Well, you just got to guess at, <laughs> at what at what somebody will take for eh, it. you're wrong. Try again. What? <laughs> no, I'm not. <laughs> Your price was wrong. Try again. Oh, yeah. <laughs> thought you were saying my statement was wrong. <laughs> nah. Negative. I am very glad... I did not have to go through the process that you're having to go through. I had it very easy. Yes, you did. I tried to make it very easy. I told my mom to move out, and I'll just buy a house. <laughs> she won't do that. It was pretty funny that I almost bought a house that was identical to yours, just reversed. Yeah. I mean, that's, you know. 
That's not that surprising in all honesty. When you look around here and you start paying attention to oh, cookie cutter home to, to cookie cutter homes like that. Which is not you know, it's not necessarily a bad thing. A cookie cutter. A cookie cutter home. Not necessarily a bad thing, but I mean it just there's the the bigger names that built at the same time or in the same time frame, they all kinda look uh they all kind of look the same. Uh, Lego Geek, I have yet to see it. Richard just told me they dropped it on Lego's website. So I haven't even looked at it yet. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, what? A piece at the ground. One of these little red studs. Oh, God. Be all right. Cattle find it. Um, I assume it's just like the uh, the Lamborghini is just like the, the Porsche. The Porsche. That was a fun build. When's it? When's it drop, or is it dropped? I don't know the answer to that. I just seen. I don't. I don't really like the wheels on it. Really? Yeah, they're some bobos. Look it up. They're not. I, I'm. I'm in the middle of something. Oh, sorry. Sorry. Didn't mean to interrupt you. I mean, there's a lot of pieces here. <laughs> I know. Try finding them all in a pile. Well. Take it easy, Blizzard. Yeah, see you, Blizzard. You stay safe too. Was he the? Is he the one from Australia? Philippines. Who was the one from Australia? Um, he got attacked by that bird. Yeah, that magpie done ate him. <laughs> we hadn't heard from him in a little while. Magpie sounds like a nasty pie you don't want to eat. Or a really good pie. Uh, I don't know. I know you don't know. I'm running out of room. That's what I thought. Yeah, I don't know. The I like doing the Porsche a lot. The only thing is, is it's a lot to do in one sitting. It really is, but it's not one that can be broken up very easily. What do you mean? Like, I don't know. You'll see when this one goes together. If we stop at the I'm right... I'm talking about this. I'm talking about the, the Lamborghini and the Porsche. I'm, I'm using this as an example. Oh. Whenever we go together with this, you'll you'll kind of see, like, there's some really good stopping points in here. Like, you can build one-third of it and stop and, you know. I don't know if we could have done that during the Porsche, though. That's what I'm, that's, that's what I'm getting at. Is that what you're getting at? Yeah, that's what I'm, I don't that's, know if we could have done it with the Porsche. That's what I'm putting down, and you just picked it up. But I'm not. I'm not sure we done that with the Porsche. Exactly. I still want. That's what I want Andy to do. Andy's into buying these Lego sets. I want him to buy a, a Technic piece. Yeah, like a hard Technic set. Yeah. I mean, I guess we're at the age now to where I don't understand what hard is. Because none of this is actually hard. Eh, it's not. It's There's not hard. Legos aren't hard in general. No. But I mean, hard I can... would be putting it together with no instructions and then getting told you're wrong. Yeah, I don't want to do that. Or hard would be looking for a piece that you probably didn't put in the bag. What are you looking for? That. You want? I need one more of them. Oh, it's probably there. That's, oh, found it. Told you. I just needed you to give me some guidance. I did. He said there appears to be no more room on your shelf, so do you plan on putting that thing? Uh, well, <laughs> the goal is, is to move down here a little bit and set up a little differently. But also at the same time, uh, if this house thing goes through... I'm not going to touch any of this. What I'll probably do is when we set the room up, do like a tour, I guess, of the room and uh, do a Lego video, of, I mean a YouTube video of the Lego room and we'll actually have an entire room dedicated to Legos. Now what is exactly behind us and what will be cut out, I don't know the answer to that. Cause there's a lot of sets we got. 
Yeah. And I don't know how you choose what's worthy to be on camera and what's not. Yeah, because you're never going to fit it all. Yeah. We cycle them out. <laughs> I'm not moving the Death Star. Oh, that one's going to have to stay. <laughs> At least this one, when it goes together, is solid. Can't find another piece. Yeah, it's right there. Is that joke ever going to get old? Uh, no, neither one the one where I show you the brick and be like, look, <laughs> look at this one. I think there's some in here. <laughs> Is there really? I think so. So you get to look forward to that. I get to plan it. Watch you be the one that's got the steps. Yeah, probably. Perhaps a live tour. Yeah, maybe a live tour. Um, I don't really know when it'll be, so I'm not going to promise that because I might be looking for a house for another five years. <laughs> But we'll have I've to. already went and I've not gotten the shelves yet, but they're still there. I that might be something I go do tomorrow is pick the shelves up. But I the shelves that I have are easily obtainable. I just don't know how many I'll need. So are we gonna move down here or no? I don't know that. That's what I'm saying. I don't know. Is there a point? No. I mean, if I get accepted on that house offer, that's... I mean, you got 45, 40, 45, 45 days, days. Till, uh, till you have to move. and I don't know. I mean, I guess there'll be a week where... Unless we just cut on the camera live and watch us packing everything up. <laughs> Moving day. <laughs> oh, look. He's about to drop the... Oh, there it went. Did I not sort these yet? Or are they just the dark gray ones? Probably got two piles of the same piece over here right now. Yep, I do. There we go. So I don't know how we're gonna do it. Um, I still don't know. I need to look online and maybe what? buy some minifigure stands and find a better way to display the minifigures. <coughs> uh, I don't know if I want to display them with the sets that they came with. I don't know if I want to display them together in factions, like dark side, light side type thing. Uh, also have a crap ton of minifigures. Like, I probably have 50 Hoth Rebels over there. You got an army. That I bought for no apparent reason. Yeah, plans change. Yeah. They'll find their place somewhere. Target practice. I shot a Lego guy with a BB gun. Did you? Yeah, from pretty far away. I hit him straight in the head. His head's dented. <laughs> I was like, eh. I did toy the idea of uh, with Mark about oh, if we Oh, you're going to go there right now. If we hit 1,000 subscribers, I will put Tannerite in the Falcon and shoot it. No. No. What? You gotta go smaller. I said 10,000. Oh, I thought you said 1,000. No, 10,000. Oh, okay, then yeah. I don't know what we do for 1,000 subscribers. I mean, if you go down that road, we could do something. You just gotta go smaller. We, we can gotta... blow up everybody's favorite and start a war. The Republic gunship. Because <laughs> that's like, that would start some case right there. That How many people do you think would be mad that if I blew up a. Will it actually like destroy the Legos though? Um, or is it just gonna? Uh, it'll pro. Uh, uh, I think. So, think about this logically. To blow Tannerite, gotta have a, a, a oh, high speed the, bullet. Whatever the bullet hits is, is gonna, gonna be destroyed. Yeah. After that, I'm not sure you will find one percent <laughs> of the Legos you will be looking for. If so, you have an amazing eye, and you wouldn't be hunting for Legos over there. I feel like you just uh, dissed me a little right there. No, I didn't, because I do the same thing. Uh, I mean, I don't, I don't know if uh, Ryan will show up again. Hope he does. I'm almost positive that if we put a ad out there on YouTube, that we're blowing that up, we're the... blowing up the Falcon. Ryan will show up. <laughs> There'll probably be a lot of people that show up. I bet, I bet we would get legitimate hate for that. 
Why you gotta do that? You could have sent it to me. Exactly. People will give us that third world. Oh, I don't have the money to buy one. So and here you fair. are blowing one up. Yeah. So that piece that I dropped? I yeah. Need. Okay, we'll get it. Nope, because there's one in here. <laughs> <laughs> Already dipping into that pile. Well, if you would have sorted them better. <laughs> what do you mean I sorted them? You dropped it. Don't you raise your voice at me. I didn't raise my voice. I raised my pitch. Young man, you will go to bed with no dessert. Wow, I done had Oreos you done brought down here. Exactly. See, I'm a nice friend. You are. Sharing Oreos. Well, I couldn't just come down here with a handful of Oreos and not give you some. That'd be disrespectful. <laughs> Plus, you'd fat shame me. Yeah, I would. <laughs> Just because you didn't bring me none. <laughs> See, since you brought me some, I'm not fat shaming you. <laughs> then you would disappear and come back with a pack of them <laughs> like you did the donuts. You told me to get you donuts. Speaking of which, Nicole stopped and got us Krispy Kreme. Us is in me and her, not you, me and you. She just told me. Richard, I'm telling you, every time I drove by that place, don't, it was lined around. Care. There was 20 people Wrong. in the drive-thru. Wrong. I don't care. Look. That wait. Caution. That wait. Of, that wait time is... Will you stop dropping stuff? Against our friendship right there. Think about it this way. I'm waiting to buy, buy a Lego set for us. Uh-huh. And you can't wait to get us donuts. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm I don't think sorry. that Lego set's uh, going to be obtainable for a little while. Which one? The Haunted Mansion? Yeah. I yeah, still don't understand no how I can like just get online the day it's released and it's already like, all right, sold out. Like, how many did y'all release? Five? Yeah, five. Wasn't it they only released two uh, Falcons on Black Friday? Isn't yeah, that but what? that was Amazon in general. Yeah. God, I, I hit that refresh button so many times. <laughs> Have I ever told you how I actually got lucky doing one doing one of those? Uh, I it was actually my KitchenAid mixer. Have I ever told you that story? Nope. Story time. So it was Black Friday, and this was like right as uh companies were really getting big on Facebook like big into Facebook into social media yeah Lowe's put up a ad right before Black Friday of you know they would be releasing they didn't tell you what it was but they would be releasing certain items at certain intervals for 90% off they did tell you it was a you know huge savings yeah 90% off uh, I think they started the closer it got they kind of told you what was coming up but you had to watch when the deal went live. Kind of, you know, same same idea as a lightning deal on Amazon. And that KitchenAid stand mixer, mixer came up for 90% off. I paid $18 for that stand mixer. Brand new. And I was sitting there. I had all the information. Why didn't you sell it? Huh? Because I used it. I still use it. Why would I sell it? So, you know when you go to... Uh I think JC Penney's does it. They have like a the first some odd people in line get a scratch off ticket. Yeah, 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 and yeah. Depending yeah. on how much the ticket is, like you scratch it off and whatever the percentage you save is. Right. Um, this was a couple years ago. I scratched one off for Sears or JC Penney, whatever's. I think it was probably Penney's. It's a mall in front of uh, Texas Roadhouse. Penney's. So, uh, but I scratched one off and I won. It was like two hundred fifty dollars, and of course everybody in the line behind me was like, "Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god!" This guy walked up to me. And he was like, "Hey, I'm here, uh, gonna buy, do a whole bunch of shopping for my family." Yeah. He was like, "Are you gonna use that?" And I thought he was just wanting it, and I was like, "I was like, yeah, I mean, you know, let's see what I can get." He was like, well, "I just want to let you know that if you don't want to spend the money here, I'll give you uh, two hundred dollars cash for that two hundred fifty." I was like, "Here." <laughs> there ain't nothing at JC Penney's I want. Right. <laughs> well, that's a different story. But I mean, you know, I still use that mixer. So why would I have sold that for less than what somebody would have bought a brand new one for? 
Because otherwise, why would you buy, you know? I don't know. I'm just seeing an opportunity. And then I have to go buy one. When we won that bike right there, somebody offered her money for it, and she said no. I was like, why? Well, I mean, that sits there, so I can understand <laughs> that. Still that thing. Yeah. I don't like getting in arguments with her about that stuff. About stuff that just sits around the house. It always backfires on me. <laughs> <laughs> this has got a purpose. <laughs> yeah, but that? <laughs> oh, well, yeah. Don't know about that. Backdrop for the YouTubes. So, does it have me do this? Okay, it does. What? It says build this twice, but I was going to see. I was seeing if it has me build two of these, which I know oh. it does. He said that somebody did a drop test on the Falcon. It was great. I don't know about dropping mine. If I'm going to do something, I just want it to be permanent and done. <laughs> AKA, we're going to go big. <laughs> and what's bigger? What's more fun? <laughs> yeah, what's more fun than one, pissing off YouTube? Cause oh, it's going to start some hate. I'm guns. telling you that. No, I'm not even talking about the people. Oh, it'll... They're going to piss off YouTube just because guns. Is YouTube completely against guns? Oh, God, yes. Why do they have so many people who do it then? They're not doing what they used to. I mean, they're not at the level they were at. Like, what's that old man that shoots guns all the time? Jerry Michalak. Is that his name? Yeah. Or Michalak. It's, it's Michalak. Something close. I'm close. Michelin, man. I remember that because of Ed. Eddie boy. So on another note, start a good conversation. Okay. Uh, started watching all the Marvel movies. I think we talked about it last week a little. Did we? I don't know. Uh, I, I don't remember. Haley, has, my fiance, has never watched... Um, she I'm not going to say never watched. She's watched some of the Marvel movies, but she hasn't like really paid them attention, paid them attention. So she agreed to sit down and watch them all with me. And we started We with, did talk about this, I remember. Uh, at the beginning, with Iron Man. Or, sorry, Captain America. And we are at Avengers 1 now. We just watched it. And so far, she has realized how quick it picks up once you get to Avengers. Uh, Lego Geek, what are you are you talking like Technic set? Like what car would we want to see done? <clears throat> I already know what kind of car I'd like to see done. From movie wise? Oh, movie wise? Yeah. I don't know about movie. I'd have to think about that one. Because there's one I... I yes, I do. Movie-wise. What? Ghostbusters. The Ecto-1. Yeah. I'll give you that. I I have came close to buying the non-Lego one. I'm going to go... Uh, I'm going to go a little ricer on you to, to go with the collection. The Supra. Really? Fast and Furious. If you got the Charger, why yeah, wouldn't but... you do the Supra with it? Out of all movies, though, I, I really legitimately can't find this piece, Mark. What is it? This. Right here. But solid. Just a solid circle? Yeah. Um, like, it's not over here. Well, how important is it? I don't know. I can tell you where one's at. Okay. I'm sure we'll find one, for real. It probably just got, it's not this, is it? No. Nah. It's got, it's a solid piece? Yeah. We'll get up and get it. It looks like this, but it's dark gray. And then the extras, man. Mike, for real, that we also could have not, you know, that might have been missing. Because when we got down to pulling this step apart, everything, we knew everything went in one step, so... We weren't, like, checking behind. The first few steps I pulled apart, I was, like, laying them out step by step and putting them in a bag. So I think that's why it took me so long. He said anything 90s and 80s style movie st movie thing. 
Uh, yeah, mine would still be Ecto One. Ecto One's a good one. I, I like that. I would. I can. I dig it. And he said '80s and '90s. You can't go Fast and Furious. Yes, I can. He can. 2001. Try me. Try me. Bet. Yeah, you're right. Exactly. You're right. I was thinking '99 for some reason. Mm. Uh, 2001. You're right. Are you? I'm right. I'm always right. Are you? Yes. Bet me. Bet lunch. Yeah. No, I was 15. Yeah, you're right. I was 15 because one of my buddies pirated the movie and it didn't have any. Uh... Oh, 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 I wouldn't have admitted that. No, oh, it wasn't me. <laughs> I just watched it. But he downloaded it back in the days of LimeWire, I guess. And it had no sound effects to it. What? And we watched it. So, you know, when they pull up and they pull up to the sandwich shop and everybody goes, Screw! Yeah. it was just like the cars pulling up. <laughs> and they were actually a lot more quiet than normal than they. <laughs> You know what's sad? What? While uh, watching that movie? Yeah. Or, like, talking about that movie, anything? Mm -hmm. I can just about tell you how many times, since I've, how many times I've watched that movie, like the RPM range he revs up that eclipse to when he first starts off. Well, can you tell me how many gears that thing has? Because. 17. It is ungodly. <laughs> I would still. I'm Ecto one. So the DeLorean's good. Uh, yeah, the DeLorean would be cool. Uh, you know what really what sucks is the way my mind works. I don't think about anything good till after we're like done and <laughs> over, and then I'm like, oh yeah. Another set, another car that would be really cool that I would enjoy putting together. And it's not really a car movie, but the Jeep from Jurassic Park. Yeah. The like blue and or not the blue, the, the green and the red. The green and red one, yeah. The DeLorean, the Ecto, Tie Fighter. Pew. Could have swore I laid some of those down already, but I guess I didn't. Dryer's going. The Batmobile. Is still one of them I want, which is sold out to, by the way. Still. Swing and a miss. <laughs> he said, I would love to see what Lego could do with the Ghostbusters Firehouse remake, but I think the OG Ecto-1 set is going to be the best Ecto-1 for a long time. I don't see him coming back out with one. I don't know. They're doing, you know, they're redoing the movie. Well, not redoing it, but... I was about to say, what you talking about, Willis? They're uh, they're doing another Ghostbusters movie. Oh, really? And yeah, I showed I you the I preview. Did you? Because it's got the kid from Stranger Things in it. Oh yeah. Holy shit, Richard! I just got all mine sorted. It took you just about as long as it's gonna take I you. No, that's what's step. crazy, isn't it? <laughs> Sorted pretty good though. Pat myself on the back for that. What you think? <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna be here like, where'd I put that? Don't agree to that yet. Where did? There we go. I'm trying to think what else would be cool. Hey, will you fit in here? Take your helmet off. No, don't take I would, I would tell you before I said yes to the the Supra. Uh -huh. Which they they wouldn't do it because it's not as iconic at all. But I would fanboy just a little over what the skyline. Not too fast, too furious skyline. Fast and the furious skyline. The R thirty two. Uh oh, nah. That would only nah, have that's Supra. Two scenes in that movie. It's a Ferrari, pal. Mm -hmm. I just knocked over Vader. Man, Vader ain't so strong after all. I know. He just got knocked over by... A, what is this? A gun cart? Keep talking. We're going to make <laughs> him fight uh, McGregor. Man, you didn't even watch that. How are you going <laughs> to just start talking like that? <laughs> you told me he hit that other guy pretty hard. He did. I got one for you. What? Would you rather take a gut punch? Oh, here we go. From Tyson. 
Oh. Or a head punch from McGregor. Oh. <laughs> Gut, definitely. Really? Yeah, I don't want to get hit in the head. <laughs> you take a knockout over, like, internal damage? I mean, you would take internal damage over a knockout? Yeah. Definitely. Stand up. Man, come on. You get knocked out, you wake up, feel, you know, refreshed. Do you? I don't know. I've never been knocked out. Because <laughs> I don't think you do. <laughs> I mean, I'm sure you're going to have a little bit of a if you get If you get knocked out, that's permanent damage, too. Yeah. Technically. You get concussed. Did they seriously make this have room for a mini food? He said, I think the 2021 Ghostbuster Ecto-1 is going to be beat up in like the trailers and we'll have a gunner seat so it won't be the OG Ecto-1, which is the only one I care about. I agree with you there. It, uh, I know they've already showed in the preview how it pops out of the passenger seat of the rear. But as a Ghostbusters fan, I'm just glad they're doing it again. Are you looking it up? Looking up the Lamborghini. Oh. Another vehicle from my childhood from the 80s and 90s that I would love to see in Lego form would still be the Megazord. A whole uh, Power Ranger set. I don't know if they would ever do that. No, That's they wouldn't. Lot. Well, in minifig size, that really wouldn't be that much. It'd be the same as Voltron. Still don't know why they would do Voltron over. It saddens me. There should be nobody out there that likes Voltron more than Power Rangers. Oh, another one I would like to see. And I think it's actually a Lego set. What? I'm almost positive it is. The what? James Bond DB7. I know they have an Aston Martin. I just can't think of which one it is. I remember seeing one. Do you get an email off of new stuff? Is that how you keep seeing these? Yeah. Because I know you don't go just go and hunt through these. No, I get emails every time they post something. I'm good like that. Oh, yeah. I don't care for the wheels. Yeah, I told uh, you. It's a weird color combination. The wheels make it look gaudy. Yeah. But it's powered. It is. That is expensive. Yeah, I was like to say, but it's also $380. Yeah. Isn't the, isn't the uh, Bugatti the same price? Uh, Isn't it expensive? Gotti, I think, is like three fifty. Yeah, I mean that's thirty seven hundred pieces. It's a big set. Yeah. All right, you and Andy got to build that in one night. <laughs> I mean, I know I'd, I know I'd finish first, but <laughs> trash talking has begun. When you need to make sure you bring the referee shirt. It's gonna be a little big on me, but. So, I think you just need to buy a white shirt because I had to de-referee my referee shirt because some uh, laundry detergent got dropped on it because it was just sitting on top of my dryer. <clears throat> so, you still have the tape here somewhere. Yeah. yeah. You, you just need to de You need to just buy a white shirt. I got some upstairs. There you go. You ain't got to buy a white shirt then. All right. So, I know he's got blue pants on. I assume that's how this goes. This goes. Nose goes here. Does it back? Yeah. Nose goes. He said there's a Power Ranger OG headquarters set on Lego Ideas I wanted to be made since I was 10. You're talking about the one with Alpha 5? Did Alpha 5 remind you of Urkel? No. Alpha remind Alpha Five reminded me of Short Circuit. Just blew your mind right there because you don't know what I'm talking about, do you? Um, no. Google Short Circuit. I guarantee you, you know what I'm talking about. I probably do. 
The robot movie. Johnny Five is alive. I'm trying to. I'm really? trying to think. Really, man, you let me down. I'm trying to think. Hey, you really do. Would the smirky face go on Luke or Han? It depends on who you want to be smirking. Did he just kiss his sister? Uh, 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 yep. <laughs> <laughs> Wrong movie. Wasn't it? Yeah. Still the same guy. <laughs> Alright, Google it so you know what I'm talking about. Hold on a second. There's no time for you to be holding on. I'm tired of talking about stuff. Luke that looks you don't weird know with Han's hair. About. Yeah, that's definitely Han. Han Solo. He's not Asian. I was saying it in Maz's voice. Why is there so many weapons? None of my guys had any weapons except for Vader. Were they supposed to? Uh, it didn't show it in the pictures. Okay. I put the gun in the cart, but it didn't show me giving that to anybody. I mean, look at this. I got four... Four uh, suppressed pistols over here. Actually, I guess they're rifles. Yeah, they got butt stocks. Makes it a rifle. He said you have to know SS. And you don't. So now you still have to Google it, it. Yeah, I have to Google it. Because I can't picture it in my head. Look. They even made like four movies. He is maybe not going to miss. He will. There you go. Our YouTubers are ready, ready and waiting on you to find out who Johnny Five is. I'm having too much fun with my dual wield stormtroopers. Double the miss, double the fun. There we go. Say no that you've never seen this. I want you to know that the rest of this live stream will be stopped and let you watch this movie while I'm building. Well, that's it for this week because I don't. You've remember never the... seen that. Look like a knockoff ET. <laughs> I've never seen this. <laughs> if I have, I don't remember it. It's a good movie. Look, there's the short circuit I know. <laughs> Who made it? You don't even know, do you? <laughs> I don't know who makes most movies today. Yeah, you do. Disney. <laughs> True. True that. Man, you know, I literally just watched Wally for the first time recently. What? I never saw Wally when it came out, and it was a Wally. really good movie. The movie's sad. It is. I'm telling you what, as a grown adult, you want me to like tear up a little? All you gotta do is put some kid movies on. Really? Dude, look what? at Toy Story. Man, uh, I mean, a little bit. I see where you're, especially Toy Story 4. All right, are you sure there was not more than one bag and bag one? Yeah. Because I'm already missing more pieces. What are you missing? These. Well, I probably I might have some of those. So I need five of them. We can barter. <laughs> You're going to you steal go. from bags until you ain't got nothing left. Well, see, so he whenever... Said maybe he should change his name to Movie Geek instead. Whenever we, I was pulling these apart... Now you're like going you to kinda, explain and see once again. No, you kind of lose. Worlds. Like whenever you're going you're backwards, right. you don't know exactly where they go, and it could have been like, oh, I left laid, those out. I thought you said you laid them out with every. No, once we got in, yeah, like when Nicole started helping me. No. Oh, so now I mean, you're blaming it on Nicole. No. You said when Nicole started helping me. I stopped <laughs> laying out step by step because it really did take too long. Like, why did four minifigs end up with seven guns? Packing, bro. <laughs> That's why they miss. Look, you got to shoulder these weapons. <laughs> Can you imagine holding a double barrel shotgun in each hand? <laughs> you know who can do that? Who? Terry Crews. I've seen him. Yeah. I 
Does it have to be 12 gauges? Uh, or if it's an AA-12, I could say I could do that. Uh, we I, all could do that. I don't know about that. Have you ever shot one of those? No, neither have you. Uh, an AA-12? No, but an AR-style That's shotgun, not yes. what an AA-12 is. Though. I know that, but an AA-12 is fully automatic. Yeah, but it just, like, I don't know. They're made to do that. All right, I need two more pieces. Same ones? Nope. You might need a third. Because uh, I literally only I have three of those. It replaces it with this. Just kidding. I'm telling you, I really thought Step 5 had two bags. Uh, Lego Geek, what's your favorite movie? Whatever it is, I'm sure Mark's not seen it anyway. I mean, if you go 80s, yeah, probably not. I feel like I missed a lot of movies in the 80s. I mean, I'm gonna tell you what. Growing up, me dating Haley now, uh -huh. or going over what we've seen as a young kid, uh -huh. and what she has not seen, and what I thought she should have seen. Look, see, that might be yours too. Is, I have one. Is really two way different things. Like it really bugged me that she hadn't seen the Goonies. I made her sit down and watch the Goonies. <laughs> what are you laughing at? The Goonies is one of the best movies. Mm. Mm. I don't remember it that much. What? I really don't. God. You disappoint me. I'm sorry. As a friend and a partner. Oh, we're going there, are we? Life partner right now? You're disappointing me. Uh -huh. It works. <laughs> At least I have low expectations. <laughs> Low expectations. You know one thing I'm glad about whenever you get this new house? What? I feel like every time I come down here, I get stopped up. I don't understand why. I, it's got to be the moisture in the air down here because we're in a basement. You probably should put that on first, but whatever. I'm good at squeezing things in a tight hole. Come on now. Different channel. <laughs> keep it keep it PG. That was. Are you saying it wasn't? Are you willing to explain? No. So if this set was put together for so long, why won't this thing bend right? Because <laughs> you're bending it the wrong way. No, that's how it goes. No, but if you flip it, does it stay bent right? <laughs> for railings, they don't fall off of the Death Star. Exactly. <laughs> yeah. I feel like that would be flawed. <laughs> My favorite older movie... Say Jurassic Park. It's not really that old. Well, how old are we talking? 90s. 90s? Yeah. Early 90s. Early-ish 90s. Favorite movie. Early-ish 90s. I'd say Jurassic Park. I didn't see that coming. I really like Jurassic Park. I mean, I do too. That was, but I mean, that was a like a big thing, that especially when I was a kid. Better than most movies now. Oh, I know. It's made great. <laughs> Like, something I grew up with in my childhood, I'd have to say Jurassic Park. That left, uh... Impression. Impression, yeah. Because I remember it scaring the pee out of me whenever I watched it in theaters. Literally. I had to pee, like, six times throughout that movie. You know what my, one of my favorite things about that movie was? What? They kept DNA held in a Clarisel bottle. <laughs> I don't know if I... Oh, hold on. No, it wasn't DNA. It wasn't a... I thought it was a uh, shaving cream. That's what it's called. Claire. What is it? I don't remember what it's called. He said his favorite movie is Firebird. And I've never seen that. I was about to say, I'm not sure what Firebird is. Now he's about to pick on us. Yeah. Scrubs. <laughs> I've never seen Firebird. <laughs> Favorite movie growing up? I feel like you're about to bust out some dumb shit and say a horror movie. Uh, so, well, no. I, I mean, horror movies will always be my favorite. But the thing about horror movies is the movies that I've liked growing up, uh -huh. have, in my opinion, most of them have been outdone by other movies with the same concept. Like Jaws, 
Yeah. I'm sorry. I, as much as people are going to hate me for saying it, The Shallows was a good movie. Mm. And The Shallows. Is that the one that got stuck on the buoy? Yeah, the one girl. It was two actors in the entire movie. Yeah. I, mm, it was suspenseful. I will give you that. But that's a whole different kind of movie than Jaws. Yeah, but... Like... I was just saying shark movie. Yeah. Do you want to know something I don't think I've ever watched? Is the original Alien movie. What? I can't remember it. I'm sure if I sat down and watch it... You know, I know the story behind it. Ridley Scott's Alien. But I don't know if... Hell, man, I didn't watch Exorcist till I was in college. That movie... Mess with you a little? Yeah. Really? That movie's freaky. Like, that movie holds up today. To be uh, made in the 70s, that movie is still scary. Um, see, that's the thing, though. When it goes back to... I have a demented mind as it is. Yeah. And I've not seen a movie yet that, like, really... I guess you could say bothered me. So, It Chapter 2... He hasn't watched it yet, right? Chapter 2? No. Yeah. It Chapter 2, uh, It the the remake of It was great. I remember the original scaring me so bad when I was a kid. When I tried watching it, when or I saw it like on TV or something when I was Be really little. little huh? Be a little there no, too. I stopped watching it. Really? Yeah, but I mean, I was really young when I, like I saw it on TV or something. So what, to go back to that, Yeah. I don't remember what came, I didn't watch them when they first came out, of course. But one of the things that I've never been able to be scared of it for uh -huh. is because when I picture him, one of the only things I picture is Rocky Horror Picture Show. Really? Yeah. Well, I don't, I've never seen it. I've never really? watched Rocky Horror Picture Show. It's it's strange. Yeah, I've heard it is. Nicole told me it is. I'm surprised she hadn't tried to make me watch it yet. It I do just, know that. It was just one of those movies that I honestly watched because it was like a... You have to watch this. So, so you as a movie person, even though you own all the DVDs, I don't know if you've seen it on their Facebook, but HBO has come out with their new streaming service uh -huh. called HBO Max. Yeah, I've seen that. Okay. They have a ton of stuff on there. Uh -huh. Some old stuff, too. Like They got like Looney Tunes collection on there, which is cool. I don't care who you are. Best cartoons ever. Fight me. What, Looney Tunes? Yes. I agree with you there. That's uh, I'm going to tell you right now. Well, there's some more pieces I need. What? What are they? I need, right now, two, four, two by fours. Uh, uh, but they have all the Harry Potters on HBO Max. Yeah, I've already saw all of them. I know, but Nicole's like, okay, we're watching them all. Like, we're, we're going to sit down and... Haley still has yet to see... The last two movies, I think. You gotta think though. So, Harry Potter came out in a time where I hate to like actually admit this, but I read them. Did you? I mean, I don't know why I hate to admit it. I can read, but <laughs> it was just like it was. So when one came out, right? I read the read the book. Which one was one? I need another piece. What piece? A uh, two by eight. A two by eight. Yeah. That's probably that's which definitely gotta be yours. One? Yeah. What? Which? Which? Chamber of Secrets. Okay. What was two? Prisoner of Azkaban. No. That was three. Two. Oh, sorry. One is Sorcerer's Stone. Two is Chamber of Secrets. Three is Prisoner of Azkaban. We had to read Prisoner of Azkaban in my English like one hundred and one class at college. Really? Yeah. He was like, here, read this. We watched CSI during this class. I'm not sure what he did. Like, I really don't <laughs> know. But, like, your first English class, like your first year core class of English, we were reading Harry Potter. So, well, I got a question real quick. But I don't remember a damn thing are, about it. Why did you have to take English in college? You have to. It's core class. No, you didn't. Yes, you do. I tested out of it. It is a core class. I don't even think... I tested out of it and math. And I, 100%. At for Tech? Yeah. Okay, this is... Well, I mean, still... It, it doesn't matter, though. It's required for your degree. You have to take it. See, I did not. I had to do You a, can test out of 
certain maths, but you have to still go into algebra. What? What? What are you looking for? I'm done. Do you not see all these pieces? I have? <laughs> cool. <laughs> Hand them over. I'll sort them. <laughs> Actually, just hold on to them over there. No, that one goes. You have a stack of those. Yeah. He said it. It too okay. wasn't as good as the first, but it's more of a comedy. Also, it too was a comedy. I will agree to that. It was funny, and that is weird to say about it. But it was funny. It was funny, or it was it, funny. it was funny. It was funny. Okay, so none of these guys get long guns. <laughs> Don't know where those come from. Both of those. Get I have a feeling these guys are gonna get in the way. Pew pew. But one of my favorite movies growing up. Yeah. And I could watch till this day yeah. a thousand times. What? Space Jam. Yes. We're not the monsters, we're the monsters. Oh man, that went way up there. <laughs> well there's that. <laughs> we need a we need like a retractor system. <laughs> Yeah, I'm Space looking at that bag like, why are you handing this to me? Space Jam, I could watch countless times. Hey, I found that string. Yep. Oh, it's still tied. Yeah, but you got to tie it somewhere else, so I didn't cut both ends. Oh. Space Jam is on Netflix right now, isn't it? I don't know. Something like that, maybe? I got it on the Razor Blue. I'm excited about the remake coming out, even though it's got. I just hope they don't butcher it. I know, but like that's. I feel like that. Like I used to tell my mom about movies, and she was like, "Yeah, I know," and like songs, and she'd be like, "Yeah, I know that." You know, that came out when I was blah blah blah. Yeah. The new one sucked. Now I feel like I'm being that old person. You are. But I mean, I guess that's just that's a rite of passage. Hey, you like this? Like, Told you, it had them. There's probably a bunch I'm of them in there. Trash compactor. Yeah. But there's also a bunch of movies like, so I'll have to admit there's some movies I think that they could do no wrong in, and one of them is Zombieland. Yes. Zombieland one and two were awesome movies. One is still better than two. Oh but yeah, Two was good. It's time to nut up or shut up. And I think uh, Woody Harrelson made that movie. Yes. I'm trying to think of other movies I just watched a lot growing up. Another movie, and now it's a kid's movie, so like, remember I was growing up. Uh -huh. And this was an 80s movie. Uh, I got probably blaster. haven't seen it. Uh, Honey, I Shrunk the Kids. Oh, yeah. That movie to me I, was... It uh, wasn't... I mean, it was... I watched it. It's just never one of my favorites. I don't know why. I cannot answer that question. But hands down, two that I could watch every day and be fine with it is The Goonies and Space Jam. He said, I love Space Jam, can't wait for the second coming out soon, but we were leaked images of Pennywise and the Joker in it, and I hate that. In Space Jam? There were images of them leaked out in Space Jam? I didn't know that. I, I didn't either, but... Now you got me thinking, like, what other movies did I watch growing up? <laughs> it's hard to remember back sometimes, ain't it? No, it's just like, I remember, like, the movie that made the most impact on me. Yeah. And it's sad to say, like, not impact in, like, oh my god, you know, this scared me or I had to live my life like this. Yeah. But what just made me really, like, I guess realize what acting could do. Uh-huh. And it's so dumb to think this, but the Texas Chainsaw Massacre. Okay. 
mean, they just, I mean, it was a family that literally pretty much had a, I mean, I, he didn't have, it wasn't Down syndrome, but a disabled, mentally unstable kid, and he was like, no matter what they, no matter what he done, they were just like, okay, you know, you're being you. And the acting in it was horrible, but it made it a great movie. Are you talking the original I said? Yes, yes. The one where at the end of the movie he swings a chainsaw in the middle of the road for 20 minutes. <laughs> Fast and the Furious is one of them. I could watch that movie. Over and over and over? Oh my god, yeah. And just pick on it every time. Haley doesn't like watching movies with me because if they're one of my favorite movies and I've seen them a lot, you repeat the lines. I quote it and she gets <laughs> mad at me. That doesn't surprise me. The Buster didn't run back to the force. He brought me back. I never knocked on nobody. <laughs> the police broke into my house, disrespected me in front of my family. Is someone talking? And that was you. All right, you gotta hand me one of them orange. All right, right there. Let me back. Trade your piece back. You really messed up. Man, I, I had three. I got a bunch of them. If you need them. No, I, I think you're gonna need them. Oh. Maybe. We'll find out. He said, "There's a movie I watched called Sex Tape, and it was really, really good." Oh, sex Warner. Tape was hilarious. Yeah. So I will tell you though. Sex tape was funny, but if you haven't watched Zach and Mary make a porno, oh my god, that's better. <laughs> um, so our old GM, Greg Rawson, yeah. yeah, walked downstairs one night. I think uh, Vader just fell. And this was when it was late night; we weren't doing anything. And I was sitting there, and it was playing, and it was towards the end of the movie where, uh. I don't remember who it was, but he just like bent over in front of the fridge. Oh yeah! And all you see is his nuts and his asshole, and he walked up and was standing there. <laughs> and he's like, uh, "What you watching?" <laughs> Nothing. Like uh, Zach and Mary make a porno. <laughs> so he's like, "Huh?" So yeah, it's a funny movie. There's a bunch. I of mean, he was cool movies. about it. Like nothing ever happened. Uh, it was just funny that he walks up at that time. There's a bunch of funny movies that came with, like, those actors, though. Oh, yeah. So, have you watched um, Wrong Missy on Netflix? No. You need to. It's funny. It's an Adam Sandler movie without Adam Sandler, though. It's got Rob Schneider movie. in it, and it's got all of Wait, them. Wait, yes. Where he... They go... They call it's David Spade? Missy. Yes, yes, yes. Me and Haley just watched Hilarious. that. Hilarious. That movie was so funny. And it was missing Adam Sandler, though. Like, I, don't, I don't know. Like, I don't know what he could have done. There it's was, just everybody was in the, You know he made that. He had to have produced oh, that yeah, movie. Yeah, yeah. But I, I resent Adam Sandler. Really? Yeah. Why? You ever seen Just Go With It? Yeah. Yeah. You got another one of those over there? Oh, vent pieces. I'm missing one. Mm, nope. Well. Uh. We'll find it. But, uh, I resent him because of that movie. Really? Yeah. Why? No one should be with Jennifer Anderson. Oh. Except you, is that what you're trying to say? Yeah. Yeah. yeah I'm just, I'm sitting here shoot, shooting my shot, man. Sometimes you get one. Good luck. <laughs> nah, Adam Sandler's hilarious. I just think that he's one of those, it's the same thing, kind of like kids' movies. You know, kids' movies used to be extremely funny, like kid humor. And now you watch them, and they're, they're like a lot of big morals to them. And, like, they try to, like in Toy Story, about, you know, not being the one that was left alone, like, you know, cast aside type thing. What are you looking for? A one by four, this. What is it? I don't know, but I'm taking it. Man, we're going to come up with some pieces missing. <laughs> We successfully suck at separating sets when they're built. All the one by fours I have are the like the modified where you put the studs on the front. Yeah. But um, he was he just had really dumb humor, and now it's all 
sentimental and crap. Yeah. Yeah. Sometimes. sometimes. Yeah, I mean, you gotta grow up. Billy Madison? Loved it. God, that teacher. <laughs> Who, Chris Farley? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, definitely. He said, I watch a lot of movie reviewers, which is why I know so much about films. I don't watch nothing about films, honestly. Like, I've gotten to where I am such a... Hater? No, I'm not a hater. I just hate I hate <laughs> watching things that give it away. Like, I don't even watch... Like, I try so hard not to watch trailers anymore. Really? I don't, like... If oh, you gotta movie, get hyped for it. Yeah, I know that, but what sucks is, is you watch the trailer, and then you go watch the movie, and you're like, oh, I've seen all of this in the trailer. Uh, and that's except all that Marvel. Well, yeah. Because you know they hide that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And they hide it very well. The one thing I've hid from Haley while watching this Marvel series yeah. is all the end credits. Why? Because it makes no sense if you watch them out of order. But it gives you something to be like, hey, what was that about? It makes no sense. No, you've got to go. You have to do that. It is part of the movie. Mark, it makes no sense if you watch them the other way they're supposed to be watched. Yes, it does. No, it doesn't. Yes, it does. They still build in the story. Give me an example. All right. Have you seen... Um, I have seen them all, so all right. yes. So then you tell me, what's the one on the end of Iron Man 2? <sighs> put me on the spot like that. I don't remember. I, I know so I've name watched any, it. Name one you know. See, now you don't even know any of them. Uh, okay. I see what you're saying because at the end of Endgame, they show the Captain Marvel. They show Captain Marvel. All right, how is no, that? No, no, no. That's going to make sense because all they show is him dropping the pager with Captain Marvel's logo. But if you watch them in order, Captain Marvel's already right. taken place and you know her logo. What's so thing? you know who they're calling. Yeah. Well, that, okay. yes. Okay. But if you watch the other ones that, like... See, you knocked my crap off again. <laughs> if you watch some of the other ones... I'll pull one up in a second. Hold on. Let me get these sorted. Uh-oh. Hey. <laughs> I didn't put that there. You did. I did. <laughs> they're, not, they're not held in yet. <laughs> I'm working on that. Yeah, I was about to say... I. It, that's hard to think about because I know what happens, so they make sense. He said that he loves Police Academy. Police Academy was hilarious. Uh, Naked Gun was hilarious. So those are going above your head, ain't they? No, I've what? I've, maybe not all the Naked Guns. I've seen all of them. I don't. One and a half, two and a half, three four and, and half. forty-four, or four, whatever the hell it is, forty-four. <laughs> Still sort. Oh, because you're looking that up. Yeah. Here it doesn't have the the movies in order. It show, it just tells you what the end screen the end scenes are. So what is at the end of Iron Man two? Because I can't remember that one off the top of my head. So the way you're supposed to watch the movies, like this one right here, is a perfect example. Okay. The way you're supposed to watch the movies. Right. And the way this, the way they came out, is a little weird, because at the end of Iron Man two. It says, uh, Paulson drives towards a crater in New Mexico desert where a large hammer is crashed and Thor. reports. Yeah. So it's Thor. You watch Thor after Iron Man 2. Yeah. But that's how they came out. 
In chronological order, Thor happens after Iron Man 2, though, correct? Uh, Not in release uh, order. Hold on. We just watched these. I'm pretty sure you watch Iron Man 1 and 2 back to back. Yeah, you do. Okay, so at the end of Iron Man 2, it introduces Thor, and then Thor comes out. That, what I'm waiting for her to see... Yeah. You need to let her watch so no, the credits. You watch Iron Man uh, 2, and then The Incredible Hulk. And then Thor. Yeah. And then in Still. The Incredible Hulk, they tell you that they're building a team. At the end of Iron Man 1, they tell you they're building a team. And at the end of Captain or uh, America, they tell you they're building a team. That's a lot of team building. I don't remember all that, but okay. I'm almost I'm almost positive. That's a lot of team building. In Iron Man, it says Stark enters his mansion to be greeted by Nick Fury, Fury who yeah. assumes that him that Iron Man isn't the only superhero in the world, bringing up the Avengers Initiative. Right. In the Hulk, it says Tony Stark meets a drunken Thaddeus Ross at a bar and tells him that a team is being put together. Okay. And Thor, it says foreshadowing the Avengers, Nick Fury, Fury welcomes Eric Nick to Fury. a S.H.I.E.L.D. facility <laughs> and after showing him the test rack, asks him to investigate the object further. And which one? Thor. And so, then Captain hold America, on, hold on, hold a cutscene from the Avengers, Nick Fury gives Steve Rogers an assignment with worldwide ramifications. Into the Spider-Verse was really good, but I would not call it the best MCU film. Not at all. Nowhere even close. Not in my book. Did you like Into the Spider-Verse? It was good, but I don't put it on the same yeah, it's scale not, as... It's the big movies. Yeah. I think of it like I do Star Wars Solo. Yeah. Like it was cool, but it didn't top the other ones. No. So, in those five movies, he's talking about the Avengers. Right. And then at the end of the Avengers is the first one that actually releases what to like come, like the foreshadowing of what is oh, about Thanos, to happen. Yeah. No, it's death. It's not Thanos. Really? It's Thanos is in it and he smiles, but death is the one that tells them... Huh. I just I, it, it's remembering some of that stuff because it's been a while. And then at the end of that, because you know the Avengers has two end scenes. Yeah, yeah. And then at the end of that is when they assemble at the Shawarma Palace to eat and silence dude. Which is battle. nothing. Yeah, yeah that, that's just, just a funny nod to them going to get in Shawarma. Which do you ever eat Shawarma? No, I don't either. I haven't either. I don't know what it is. I thought it was something fake. No, no, it's actually real food. And so here's another one. So after after you watch the Avengers, uh -huh. you watch Iron Man three and then Thor: Dark World. Correct. All right. At the end of Iron Man three, it's uh, him telling his battle. Uh, it's Tony Stark telling his battle. Yeah. With him and Killian. Yeah to Bruce Banner and he realizes that Bruce Banner's asleep. Yeah. Then at the end of Thor, which would be the next movie, right? It's foreshad foreshadowing the Gar Guardians of the Galaxy. Right. After th after when Thor, are you Dark World. In that, in that when you're supposed to watch Guardians though? No, it's Captain America Winter Soldier. But then you watch Guardians. You don't watch Guardians before any of this is what I'm trying to say. No, Guardians is after Winter Soldier. So, once again, so it just, they're a little off-putting. A Not little, major, but, but you still... That's what, so... That's part of the movies. You've got to do it. What's going on, Ed? How's it going? So with Haley probably not watching this and probably not going to watch this far in, uh, she was really sad when Bucky fell off of the train. Right. So when it comes to Winter Soldier... Um, that's about to say where to go. She's going to find it out. Then she'll be like, Oh my God, he's still alive. Why does he have a fake arm? <laughs> well, 
What I will honestly admit, though, uh-huh. that I did not know uh-huh. is that they re- they brought in Hawkeye and Thor. Really? I did not remember that happening that way. I meant Breaker. I thought that they brought him in in the Avengers and was like, which they did. They were like, here, watch after them. Yeah. But they brought him in. He was in, in earlier Thor. than that, yeah. He was in the bucket about to shoot Thor with the bow and arrow when Thor was trying to pick the hammer up in the right. middle of the... Right. Would the hammer have done... Or would the arrow have done anything? Would it have pierced the skin? You know, going being the, the comic knowledge that I have yeah. and then going back and watching these movies and like actually paying more attention to them now. Right. They pumped some lead into Thor and the Hulk and Avengers for yep. it just to like bounce off. Yeah. But Loki stabbed Thor with a knife. That's a special blunt. Special <laughs> knife. I mean, plot hole. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I already remember them pieces. Which one? Uh, probably all that that entire pile I have a guess I need the long one the big piece so sitting there watching them take pretty much a 50 cal machine gun to Thor and that was also watching that movie going going back to the, the comic nerd yeah seeing Thor and the Hulk fight yeah I wish that could have been like a whole hour movie <laughs> like they need to do that like Dragon Ball Z style or do they just two guys fight for seven episodes? I don't I don't know the reference, but I get it. I get what you're saying. Dragon Ball Z. Uh, I, I get what you're saying. I just never watched Dragon Ball Z. Out. You never watched Dragon Ball Z? No. Wow, you don't know who Vegeta is? Nope. Bitch don't know about Vegeta. But yes, I am uh, I'm excited that when she watch, watches Winter Soldier. Right over there, you're flexing the table. Well, you know. Humble brag. So I have a, a slight you argument. Say problems. Oh, what? Uh, you have two minifigs uh-huh. and three, three helmets in here. What? Does Luke come with a, is it, I'm assuming this is Luke? Yeah, remember he didn't have a helmet. Uh, or okay. did he have a helmet? Uh, oh no, he had a helmet and hair. So it comes with both? Yeah. Okay. So we should put a hair on him, that way we know... We have one with a hair on him. Yeah, but if we put a Stormtrooper helmet on him, we're not going <laughs> to let's loot. We'll have to write his name on him. Hey, you got one more of those over there? I just gave you one. Uh, a lot. No. Uh oh. <laughs> well, is it in bag four? Maybe. I'm gonna need it though. I don't have that at all. Like not even in my step. Really? Maybe uh, I have enough and just. Lego miscounted. Geek said, "Did you realize how worse they've made Lola Bunny look since Space Jam? She's basically a Tom Bunny now." Uh, no, I have not. I am. I do need one, or I need to figure out where. I have not seen it. I mean, I'll be honest with you. I don't keep up with a lot of the stuff like that. Yeah, I don't. I don't but either. I'll, I'll watch it once. And now that you've said it, I'm gonna look it up. Hey, why don't you go look up and find one of those pieces? They're behind you. Are they? Where? That top box, fucking straight. Really? Behind you. Really? We gotta do this now. I mean, hold on. You still want to have another bag that way? I have to get one later? Yeah. I guess it's that is what he's talking about. I don't know. Because that's how, that's Space Jam. That's Lola. (laughs) You know I watched something. I asked G this the other day. I watched something popped up. Hold on, before you say that. No, That said Space Jam, uh, Space Jam like got us into the incest thing like pushed incest on us between Lola and Bugs Uh, yeah I didn't read the whole thing well they both have the last name of Bunny yeah it's because they're Bunny so I asked G this the other day yeah 
and he answered, of course, something that I've never heard of. And I said two right off the bat. What's that? What's that animated character that if you were animated, you'd be interested in? Jessica Rabbit. That's mine. <laughs> uh, my other one you're not gonna know that you're not gonna know who Android 18 yeah sounds familiar but no I don't know it off the top of my head I'll show you a picture what is that step 7 <laughs> <laughs> I'll find it eventually we'll get a 5 no 5 is See where this come from? There's one right so there. So that's her normal. No. Oh. But in the show. Yeah. Oh. Um. What's the uh uh rocket uh team rocket? What's her name? Uh. Does start with is it Jesse? J. Yeah. Is it Jesse? No, Jesse's the boy. Jesse the boy. What's uh Jesse and I think both of them started with J. Ah. Uh, Okay, where are they at? I'm gonna steal one. Behind you. Where at? Here? No, oh, right there. Like straight behind you. We'll replace it when we find it. As you know, we will. Put that there. We'll probably need that again. <laughs> well, apparently they have a lot member, a lot more members than I remember. Members. Members that I remember. Member, member? Member, member? You remember the members? I don't remember the members. You remember the well, members? apparently there's a lot. You don't remember the members either. Well, I didn't know there was this many. <laughs> it's Jesse and James. So it is Jesse. So yeah, sure yeah. is. Sure oh, is. Right. But still, Jessica Rabbit. Yes. Uh, come on, there's another one I just can't remember right now. Um... I don't know. I'll think of it in a minute. Who did G say? I, I don't know. Uh, you don't even remember? Anime character. Oh. Uh, Lois Griffin. <laughs> Ahsoka. Ahsoka's kind of hot. Eh, you're getting a little weird. Getting out there. How many yeah. times you going to knock that off? Eh, probably me. Close to my last time. need to watch Clone Wars. That's what I need to watch. I still have not watched Clone Wars. I know you haven't. But I need to. So, the number the rated number one sexiest cartoon character of all time. Uh -huh. Guess who it is? Who? Just take a guess. Right. I've never guessed it. I have no idea. Like, I have zero idea. Daphne from Scooby-Doo. I'm Daphne? A, yeah, I'm more of a Velma, though. Daphne was the long blonde hair. Yeah, Velma, Daphne's the, the popular one. Velma's the nerdy one. I'd take Velma. Even as... Uh... <laughs> We're having this conversation on YouTube right now. We are. <laughs> you know. What about you, Lego Geek? What do you think? What's a <laughs> what's an animated girl character that if you were animated, you'd try to go after? You got like, are we talking back in the day? Because you got like April O'Neil taking it back. I can't there. remember what she looks like, like specifically. I think like every cartoon character that was a girl, if they wanted them to look cute at all, they put red hair on them. April has red hair. Jessica Rabbit has red hair. Daphne yeah, has. Jessica Rabbit's got the 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 body curvy body, yeah. Lego Geek says, "Who's your favorite YouTuber?" Uh, are you talking about in in Lego or in general? General, because you're gonna go Bucky. No, nah. no. I, I so there's the difference in the two. I enjoy Bucky, but I enjoy Cletus. But uh, it's two yeah. way different. You've got somebody that's like teaching you things and building, showing you how to make things on your own, and 
like kind of having fun with it versus someone who is literally just going balls to the wall. <laughs> Cletus um, is probably Cletus is probably my favorite, especially right now. At least right now he is. If you're talking Lego, uh, honestly, it just depends. Uh, I used to enjoy David a lot, but the more I watch David's videos, the more I don't know. I just it's I don't know. I don't want to talk crap. I don't want to be that guy. I uh, I would probably say he said Gwen Stacy would be my animated want. You can have the animated Gwen Stacy. I want the real one. <laughs> Emma Watts. I mean Emma Stone. Gosh. Sure. That's my dream. I don't know why. Because you watched Easy A? No, it was before Easy A. Yeah, I know, but still. But I like David a lot. David's David really knows what he's talking about, and he really keeps up with Lego a lot. Uh, Rich Boy Jay is really fun to watch. He can build some amazing things. Ryan's really good. The Brick Wiz is really good. The Brick Wiz builds things very massive. The Hoonigan, is in Hoonigan Industries is probably one of the, my favorite things to watch. This is where probably a lot of these come from. I'm going to steal out of here first. Hurt is hilarious. Yeah. And even though they have all the money they have, they're very, like... I'm not going to say conservative, uh -huh. but they don't flaunt it. Humble? Yeah. Is that the word you're well, I mean, I was searching gonna, for? It's not even really that humble. They just, like, okay, I have, you know, $100,000, but let's go buy a $400 car. Yeah. Like Bucky Lassick, he's got to be, I don't want to say a millionaire, but he's about got to be. And his whole video YouTube series is him buying an $800 car. Yeah. Now it's uh, <laughs> he's put twenty grand in it, but I wonder his net worth. What do you think his net worth is? I have no idea. I don't know how big he was. Oh, he was huge. He says, "Fine, he'll be that one guy that thinks Gwen is nerd nerdly cute." <laughs> His net worth is very wide open. What, is, what do you mean? Between one and five million. Oh. I guess it depends on how much CBD is selling right now. <laughs> Not hating, but... Yeah, I have a thing for Emma Stone, so it doesn't really matter what she plays in. That automatically wins. How do I make this? How do you want to go, bro? I have to look up the animated Gwen Stacy, though. Yeah, I don't, I don't know her. One, two, three, four. Five, Wait, are six. you talking like comic Gwen Stacy, like new comic Gwen Stacy? Cause that's totally different from old comic Gwen Stacy. I just thought about that. You gotta realize, I keep up with comics. That's new comic Gwen Stacy. What's it? She's Gwenpool. Uh, and uh. What the hell is Gwenpool? Gwenpool? Mm -hmm. Like, is it Deadpool and Gwen Stacy put together? Mm -hmm. What's her superpower? Can she die? What's the pool part? Is what I'm. I'm uh, wondering. That's See? it. Uh. See, Gwenpool. Huh. That's a different outfit and everything, and she's a different character, but. How? 
Like he said that she's Deadpool's daughter. Did not know that. Do you have a one by two gray brick? Are those all corners? Mm -hmm. A light gray? No, dark gray. Just like that. So yeah, Gwen Stacy apparently uh, had a little fun with Wade Wilson. Real. The only thing I know about Gwenpool, on it, like that I'm gonna not say I don't know is when she was released, her first appearance. No. Because it was really odd that she came out in that book. You but should you should find it and wait for the movie. What? I already have her first appearance. I'll do. You. Yeah, it's in Howard the Duck number one. When was how when when did that come out? It's an it's a new Howard the Duck number one. Not oh, old, okay. Not old. I was about to say because what I mean because remember they stopped everything in the universe and restarted. No. I don't. Oh, you might not know that. No. They did it twice. Why did they do that? Answer me that. It. So I don't know. Marvel why they would DC in a way stopped everything and was like oh let's just rewrite what's already been wrote but wasn't it was it partially because they made Superman so powerful like nobody could kill him and then they had to kill him I don't I don't know about DC about the the thing about Marvel was was they restarted the characters uh huh but it really wasn't origin stories. Right. Like, you already knew who Spider-Man was, so it just... What was really cool was, was they paid a homage to a lot. Right. Like, the when they redone The Amazing Spider-Man... Yeah. The first couple books, the covers were, like, paid homage and everything to the old style. Gotcha. It says, Gwenpool originally had no superpowers... But she had fat, vast knowledge of the Marvel Universe and the free too. comic books in her universe, such as every secret identity of both heroes and villains. She has used this information to take down Black Cat's criminal empire and to stop Thor from attacking her. She is able to exploit her fourth wall knowledge to her advantage. So why would Thor be attacking her? I don't know. But you know what they mean by fourth wall, right? Yeah. yeah. Fourth dimension. Talk yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, it says... Look at the camera. Yeah. On a movie, at least. It says, Understanding when comic book tropes will allow her to avoid unpleasant or life-threatening consequences. So, her superpower is knowing that she's not real. <laughs> Interesting. I feel like some of that stuff they're stretching and they just have to they figure out to. something. Yeah, you know, it's... Hey, man. Somebody's high. He says, I meant the Spider-Verse one. I don't like anything associated with Gwen now that has now that has to have Miles Morales in it. See what I mean by it's nowhere near as big? It's not as big as I thought it was. Yeah. We got rid of that. Yeah. I mean, it gets a little... I think it might get a... Um, Hair bigger. Yeah, maybe a, a stud bigger, but it, it may not. Uh, I remember when uh, Chris came over here and we were talking about going through my comics. Yeah. And I started opening them, the boxes, and realizing like what all I actually had. Sad that you don't even know what you have. I don't. Some of the stuff up there, like I have a Spider, Amazing Spider-Man. Yeah. But I think it was like seventeen or eighteen. Uh huh. Like you know how old of a book that is? Um, no, but I, <laughs> I assume it's old. That the oldest book I have is a Spider-Man book, but I only have like two that are pre one hundred. Right. But when it comes to X-Men, I have. I think three that are pre-20, one that's pre-10, and then I have everything from like 98 to 250-something.
He says, do you think Lego will ever go past a thousand dollars for a Lego set? Um, probably. Yes. What you don't realize is the next UCS model, which is the Republic gunship, is actually going to be life size. <laughs> <laughs> it's going to be a uh, four million seven hundred ninety-five pieces. I mean, all they have to do is trip over eighty-five hundred pieces with licensing something. It would have to be licensed. Okay, so it's got to be Star Wars. So I don't know what it's going to be, but it's got to be Star Wars. I have something we can do then. What? All right, non-Star Wars. Yeah. You want to do a build. We talked about doing the pirates. Right. Hard. All right, before we order anything, uh -huh. you want to do Star Tower? Uh, that's a lot of glass pieces that we'll never reuse. And you know it is. Yeah. Are you still down to do the pirates? Yes. Very much so. After you get moved, though, I'm not. I'm not well, I'm trying to. We're gonna. I'm have not to buy, being a bad influence. I want to buy another table. Yes. And then set it up on that. Maybe to have where we can just put the camera in the middle of the room and flip sides. That way. I don't think your room's gonna be big enough. And the house that we're looking at, it is. Is it really? Yeah. If we put. I think you need to. Look how far. We are from there to there. Yeah. From the camera now, to the wall behind us. Mm -hmm. I doubt you got enough room to flip flip around like that. We'd have to move it in some, but yeah. This is weird. It just adds piece here, adds piece here, adds piece here, adds piece here. you yawn it oh because you're not doing anything right now is that what <laughs> well i could have some fun with the blasters yeah see play a little game he's sending you a picture of a comic book tell him if you think it's worth getting or not if it's a comic book i'm gonna say yes no matter what it is all right, Mark. We're gonna play a game. All right, without Jigsaw. taking off the mask. All right, Jigsaw. Which one's Luke? If you're wrong, <laughs> mm. I'm eliminating him because of his hands being up. And I'm eliminating him. Because you just picked the helmet up. No, I did not. I swear to God. Tell me if I'm right. I don't know. That's a two-faced one, so yeah. So yeah, that's Luke. That's how you cheated. No, you want to know how I know? How? Okay, so the hands up was easy because I had them yeah. holding the guns. The other one I had to lean back. You know, you have to lean them back a little bit because the guns are so heavy, and he was still lean back a little bit. Attention to detail. Damn. Got you on that one. What was you saying about who's right? No, I got that was a cheating. No, I didn't. Is it cheating? Really? No. If you're really? right, yeah. Because I, I wasn't. <laughs> he hadn't sent me a picture yet. Now he is. I hate how they went back and done all the comics again and made them all women. Come on, man. Girl power. Yeah, but it's so weird. Captain Marvel wasn't even supposed to be a girl. Yeah, I know. I don't really mind her. I like her as a girl. Or the character as a girl. The one I don't like is the fact they redid Wolverine. As a girl? Yeah. Didn't they kind of hint at that in Old Man Logan? Sort of. The little girl? No, that was uh and, uh, Not Old Man Logan, but Logan. That was X-23. Oh, was it different? That's totally different. Oh, okay. Excuse me. <laughs> but didn't she have claws? Or did she not? Yeah, she did. I was about to say, yeah. Her. Oh, okay. Well, X-23 was like the, the experiment child that had his DNA. Oh, okay. Or not DNA, but the, whatever it's called. Like, venom, ammonium. 
Hey, if you come across the vent piece that goes right there, I know we'll find it eventually. It's not one I'm really that worried about getting. Got a one by two gray plate, dark gray. One by two dark gray plate. Is that one over there somewhere? Are you serious? What the fuck? Man. Yeah. It is what it is. It do be like that sometimes, though. It really do. Need another one by three. I wonder when these pieces are gonna start showing up. Hey, where's your one by twos? They're not in here. Are they? We go get it. Nope. Please. Well, we got up once Please. for you. Oh, you got up once for you. I got up once for you. Sure set. You didn't have it in the box. Yeah, well, oh no, it's in here. <laughs> Don't make me pull one out of another bag. Cause I will. Get up, go get that piece. If you sold, if you bought that for fifty cent, you definitely have an, the opportunity to make money on. But it's still, you're not gonna sell that book for much more than two dollars and fifty cent, and that's if it's in really good condition. Uh, the way that the comics kind of go is unless that it's a key issue, nobody's gonna pay really much for them unless they're trying to get a straight run. And the bad thing about that book you have is it was done at a time where comics were just mass produced. I think you need a one by two. One by two, dark gray. Why are you even sit down? What? Just bring it over here? Nope. What? Huh? Just bring the whole thing over here. Uh. Oh. Thank you. Appreciate that. He said, I gotta go, but I'll see y'all in the next stream. See right. you later, man. Yeah, see you, Lego Geek. We uh, next week we're gonna be on a little earlier. Yeah, next week we'll be on a lot earlier. A lot earlier, like two or three hours earlier. Yeah, probably. We're gonna do. We we gonna end up like doing a cooking show in with a Lego show, because we're gonna start early and have to eat. We gonna cook. I mean, we could move it outside. <laughs> <laughs> Flipping stuff on the grill while we're cutting, while we're putting Legos together. Comics to me were like a that, that was like heroin. That was worse than Legos ever was. When I lived up in King, I was literally going to the comic book store like every Friday. Then I would get online on his auctions every day. I remember you getting on the auctions. Now I'm auctioning, trying to buy a house. I think it's 25, 25. Tell you right now, the toys just get more expensive. That's all yeah. it is. Yep. Oh. Did this go to here? All those pieces left over. <laughs> yeah, I know. Don't flip the page. It's like, all right, step three. What's a newer movie that you could watch all the time? Interstellar. Really? I love that movie. I'm not 
sure why, but it is uh, such a good movie. I could watch Pirates. Pirates of the Caribbean? Yeah. Yeah. At least the first two. Maybe not after that. Not you, Jack. We named the monkey Jack. <laughs> no one get that stuck in your head. That's better than the uh, what we thought was going to be stuck in my head. Ring, ding, ding. No, ding, not ding, that. Ding, ding, ding. What do we think was going to be so good? The, uh, I don't even remember it. Uh, I Can't Stop song. Because you were playing that on whatever that TikTok was. I don't even know what you're talking about now. The, like, dubstep oh, song? Yeah, stop. that. The one we used to make fun of uh, Kirk all the time. Yeah. That song got really annoying because it was on Forza Horizon. Yeah, was it really? Yeah. I think I probably turn the music off. When I play Xbox, I put Pandora on through the Xbox. I've done that before. I do it every time, except for when I'm playing Warzone because I got to keep it quiet to hear the footsteps. Before, uh, before the streaming stuff, when we were playing like original Xbox in college, uh, oh, when you had to download the when you had to, to the- put a CD on it, my roommate put Disturbed. Uh, I guess it was sickness. Uh, I guess it was down with sickness. Wow. Yeah, so that we would be sitting there playing like um, whatever the dirt bike game is, MTX Unleashed or something like that, and listening to Disturbed the whole time. <laughs> Man, I wish I was as lame as you. Why is that gonna be lame? <laughs> I, don't know, I just felt like saying. <laughs> Reading some house stuff. Yeah, your mama texted me. That's that's not a lie. <laughs> it is my mom texting him. Did you? Yeah, I made up my mind while sitting here. Oh, that's good. Maybe. If not, I really don't want to go look for more houses. But <laughs> Did you put something inside of these? Inside of what? Barrel. No. Why would I? I don't know. Easter egg? Maybe. <laughs> what could you hide in there to be Easter egg? I don't know. Gold. Kylo Ren's helmet. That won't fit. <laughs> Where's the third one go? Oh, it goes on this side. Right there. Right there. A lot of grabbing stuff, isn't it? Ping, ping. Pew, pew, pew. Ring, ding, 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 Surprised Batman made, ain't made it on here yet. You haven't built a room worthy of him yet. Why? Wow, the black room over here? I saw somebody put up the Bat Cave the other day for sale. It would just disappear. It's not John Cena. Oh, can we get a John Cena Lego? <laughs> WWE came out with a Lego thing, didn't they? It wasn't like nah. Lego, but... Nah, see, you missed the joke. You could have went, you could have ran with that. I didn't and even say, really. I was reading what she said. What'd oh, I say? thought you were going to look for a John Cena one. I said, "Can we get a John Cena minifigure?" He's right there. Yeah, exactly. There you <laughs> go. That's what I was waiting for. Oh, but somebody's made one. <laughs> That's what I was talking about. It's called. C3 construction. Oh. Now you know what we're about to do? What are we about to do? We might make a purchase tonight. About what? If they make one that is worthy of me buying, he will take the place of Batman. 
So what are, we, what are you buying? They have an Undertaker one. That was pretty cool. At least they got Undertaker, Triple H, The Rock. The Rock looks just like Triple H, but without hair. The Big Show. Hey, did you bring them one by twos over? I need two of them. Kane, Rey Mysterio. Those are definitely in another bag somewhere. Dark gray? Yeah, dark gray. You see why? So when you start pulling this off, yeah. they stuck to the bottom. I'm not sure about the other ones, but... That's pretty cool. Andy would be like, Ooh, Oh my god, it's, it's a Sting! Andy, they have a Lego Sting WWE figure. <laughs> they make what? How much is this? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> what? His name is Mr. Texas. What? Yeah, you can't call him Stone Cold. That's... Oh my god, I'll call it Bitch Stone Cold. Bullock. What? The back of his vest even says Bullock for you. How, how can you not call... I mean, I know how I you guess. can, but... He owns, he owns his stuff, that's why. I'm pretty sure he how does. How do you buy it? Huh? So how do you buy it? There's a purchase option, I'm sure. It wasn't. Oh. Somebody custom made it. Shopping. Mr. Texas. There's a stone cold over there. But he lives in LA. He's right there. Yeah. Did you hear me? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, but he's from Austin, Texas. Google that because I don't think that's true. Where he's from? Yeah. I don't think it's Austin. Shawn Michaels is from Austin, Texas. I think Shawn Michaels might live in Austin now. I don't know if he's from Austin. No, either. Shawn, or he was born December 18th in Austin, Texas. Oh, okay. But Shawn Michaels is from. Oh, Shawn Michaels was from Chandler, Arizona. Whoa, I missed something over here. How are you going to judge me on my Stone Cold skills? You going to get stunned right here on TV? No. Put you through a table? It's a little off. Yeah, but I think it's supposed to be. Look, red, one level, and then this. This side is red, one level, and then the inverted slope. It's just different. There ain't no way. No, you missed one I missed right there. below. That's what it is. I thought she was about to throw a flag. Wait, don't you bring that shit down here. Oh, I haven't added. That's why. There we go. What are you doing over there? You should have put him in the black room. You'd never find him. That's how you get killed easy when you lay down in Call of Duty. Free headshot. <laughs> but man, it, it makes you smaller. I hate drop killing people. Oh my god. Kill they still drop shot? Yeah. Oh my god, I hate it. So... Call of Duty kind of got away from it because you can't drop shoot. as fast anymore. Yeah, but what you can do is if you're running full speed, he'll slide. Yeah. Yeah. I wonder what game that started on. What? Drop shooting. Because Halo, you can only kneel. You couldn't lay all the way down. Couldn't lay down. I probably Call of Duty. Battlefield. I don't think you could in Battlefield either. No, you can. But can you drop shot in Battlefield? Yeah. You don't know what my favorite thing about playing Battlefield was? What? On Battlefield Bad Company 2, there used to be a level that had like a, uh, I guess like a house being built is what you would call it. Uh -huh. You could go up on top of the house, like in the top room of the house and jump off and you would glitch land in a tree and you would be standing up in the tree 
you could lay down and look out, uh -huh. and I could see everything, but no one could see me. Cheater. Yeah, kind of. <laughs> no kind of about it. <laughs> cheating. It wasn't cheating. I, I mean, it's the game's fault, not mine. That's glitching. It's cheating. You know. You can report for that. <laughs> I've already glitched Warzone. Have you? Yeah. On purpose? There's a bunch of hidden Easter eggs in Warzone. Oh. And a bunch of hidden things you got to do. Yeah, I've, I've seen uh, Chris talk about that. So if you, uh, to, you know, talk, talk, uh, talk about like, getting in the bunkers. Uh-huh. Is that what you're talking about? I don't know. So i just seen them talk like, he's, hey, Devin, come here, you know. If I get on a four-wheeler and stand up and you drive it into the door of the bunker that you have to have a key for, yeah, it'll glitch me into the bunker. Really? Sometimes. What are you looking for now? One by, or two by four plates. Two of them, light gray. Boxes, blah. Oh my God! Are you serious? Okay. Like, there's how is all these leftover parts? I don't know. Are none of them boxes where? This one. Yeah. Why can you not reach any of these boxes? Because but I, yet I have to reach behind me, and then you're just like, it's right there. Put your hand up. That's why. <laughs> now I'm gonna sit here and watch this video stream until that pops up. <laughs> Look. It goes off screen, I bet. Look. It's about to happen. Dun, 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 dun. Tell me when your hand goes up. Right here. Bah! Look at that, see? <laughs> <laughs> you got a good two foot reach on me. When my hand goes up, your mouth goes shut. Who is that? Time to nut up or shut up. No, wrong. Ramen. <laughs> I don't actually know who that was. Uh, I don't think you do either. When my hand goes up, your mouth goes shut. That's Miz. Oh, I wouldn't have known that. It took me a minute. I don't like the Miz. You don't like the Miz? Oh, you're crazy. Great. Great hill. No, he's a person. He's not a hill. Doesn't require anything to go up. Wrong kind of hill. Also, it's like the bottom of your foot he gets washed on all the time. Yeah. Yeah. That's kind of cool. I'd hate to be that guy. Oh, you didn't know? Hey. No ass better call somebody. Found it. Told you it was there. Who? Why did you trust this guy with the cart? I don't know. He looked important. But is the cart important? Yes. Or did he just get a crappy end of the deal? Eh, both. Luke. Who did it better? Huh? I said, who did it better? Who did what better? Luke, I am your father. Who Who versus who? Chris Farley. Oh, no. Come on, Tommy Boy? James Earl Jones. What? All day. Better than Tommy Boy? Yes. Come on now. No competition. Ric Flair. <laughs> Woo! <laughs> Luke! <laughs> Put that on right. Goes that way. I'm going to leave Solo just laying on the ground. But lay on top of him. Oh! Put Luke behind her? Don't do that. <laughs> That's what I know. When I need a one by one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight block. Two by eight block. One of those. Probably need uh, one more. <laughs> you almost these? Hold got on. me. Hold on. Hold on. No, I don't think I didn't turn the page. I just went back. I'm like, hold on. I did that. Oh. Hey, where'd all them? There we go. What does the fox say? Bing, ding, 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 ding. God, where did that come from? Ding, 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 ding. I've been doing it for the past like hour. 
Yeah, but the way when you do it, it sounded like. Uh, what did it sound like, Mark? Go ahead, tell me. What did the it sound frog like? from the early two thousands? You know oh. what I'm talking about? Bing, 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 ding, 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 ding. That's what oh. it sounded like you were doing, like doing the Beverly Hills thing. No, it's not Beverly or Beverly Hills. Uh, the cop. You got the best. What? Frog in the world. World is what? The Budweiser frogs. Yeah, dude. Yeah. Come on. How you gonna leave me hanging like that? Why? <laughs> you know what's my favorite thing ever? One by eight. You know what one of my favorite things was? Like, what? Oh yeah, I did make two of those. Seeing the way that, you know, when we grew up, TV really influenced like what we seen and what everybody done. Yeah. The what's up. With Scream on Scary Movie. Two by fours, plates, light gray. Do you not have any over there? Mm -mm. What the hell? You really screwed up on I me. really did. But you know on Scary Movie? Yeah. Yes. He's like, what's up? What's up? Hey, who on the phone? What's up? <laughs> and then it like came into the Dudley Boys. Yes. <laughs> Either we're gonna have a crap ton of pieces left over, <laughs> or that guy, that guy sold no, the no, set no, no, cheap no. enough for you to break link the rest of them. Nah, they're all here. They're, I'm telling you, we're gonna, you're gonna end up with a step like that where it's gonna have a bunch of pieces we're lo we have went searching for. I've been searching. I finally get to make something with these. Did you get watch Jan Silent Bob yet? No. <laughs> I disappoint you so bad. I just want you to watch one movie, and it's not even a two hour movie. Like, you can't spend an hour of your life. Oh, that's the wrong size piece. Get this one. If I got it and played it on a TV right here, would I watch it? Would it affect your building? Probably. If it's good, it would. Funny. Does that make it good? Squeaky, squeaky, squeaky. How the hell am I up? I shouldn't have trimmed my fingernails before we come in here tonight. Are you really complaining about that right now? I couldn't get a Lego apart. Any, this is like playing Go Fish. I need a uh, one by one tile and a one by six tile. You should have them laying over. Dark gray? No, light gray. One by one and a one by six. I don't have any tile. You don't have any tiles over there? I do dark gray. Light gray tiles are over there, by the way. <sighs> I'll get up for this one. Because I think I'm going to need two of them. Well, that one's just got one long piece on it. Oh, no, hold on. Never mind. Two 
did you just do? <laughs> oh my god. That's funny. <laughs> You still haven't seen it. Oh, that's why all the blasters. Give me the long guns. Huh? Give me all the long guns. All of them? Yep. And I just figured out why I didn't have one of these in the step because it didn't show me. How many do you need? Four. Oh. I've only got three. No, there should be four over there. They were both dual wielding uh, one. The other one's being hit right now. Well, get it. It's incognito. Get it. Batman does not need to lay down with it. <laughs> He's sniping right now. Give him the short gun. He's sniping. Now you got him. You got close quarters. Yeah. Is he got an armory on here? I'm touching Luke's poop, man. <laughs> <laughs> you had to go. <laughs> All right. That's. I mean, we had to get some pieces. But I only have four left yeah. over. Yeah, but you so, have another, you have hold, on, 12 hold on, hold on, hold on. Let here. me see this. What? Just let me see it real quick. So, oh, what the hell? What? I'm just trying to get my bearings straight on this. Like, there. Okay. Like you realize you messed up on something. No, I'm missing. This goes here, and this goes here. Nothing goes over there. Yeah, well. Put them in the pile. Yeah. <laughs> I'm not sure where it would go if it. You'll probably you'll probably run into these. I would assume. Put them in the pile. Oh, you did start a whole pile, didn't you? Yeah. So, so, I don't know what you did. What time is this? IDK. LOL. So, I'm thinking step four is going to be our last step. Because uh, I hate that. That's step five. And it's ten thirty, so you get through your step. I'm this step doing both two steps too. Yeah, this step don't look that big. And hopefully we'll start uh, early enough next week we can maybe finish the whole thing. Because there's only ten steps. So Next week we might do a half the stream, do a break, do the other half. Why? So we can eat. Oh. I don't like watching, like, I don't understand. Yeah, I was going to say, if we had a bunch of people talking to us, we could sit here and eat, but. Yeah. You know how that's going to go. <coughs> I'd be glad to be started before, like, 8 o'clock. Is that so? What, you? How does that make you feel? I found a vent piece. Did you? Yeah, but I got another one here. Hey, Why Richard, they have Richard, you look at this, this thing I learned. Look, look at this thing I learned. There or there? Holy crap! I know. Why didn't they have you add that? Why did I have to add I that? I don't know. So that's one, 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 three. Obi Wan's got a headset. Or yeah. Maybe he's playing Xbox. If Obi Wan had an Xbox, what would his gamer tag be? Uh I suck at gamer tags. Um Oh man. I'm not that creative when it comes to something like that. When I was like, I wanted to change mine away from mine for so long, and I'm just like, I can't think of anything. 
I keep coming up with ones, but when I try to take it, like, mine's taken. So I had a really cool one for the longest time. And it was like... Like, you want to get rid of your hatch in it, right? Yeah. Well, yeah. yeah, definitely. Yeah. Uh, my old gamer tag used to be a song by a band called Norma Jean. Uh-huh. Every song on their album uh -huh. was, like, two words mixed together to make one word, but it fit. So, like, character, uh -huh. the E-R at the end was you are. And then it was Tarantula, so it was Characterantula. And that was my name. The only thing that was funny about it is anytime I played online, you would hear somebody go, uh, Car Car hey. Yeah. I mean, you know how simple mine is, and people still screw it up, so. I feel your pain. Some people get it really easy and quick and just call me clips. And then I'm like, well, if I change it now, then it's going to be weird. Somebody will be trying to talk to me if I ever play with, like, random people again that call you by your gamer tag, and then be like, uh, huh? <laughs> Who is this? Who are you what talking to? You like, dude, why are you not answering me, huh? Oh, shit. I just I changed my tag. I was going to change mine if my tag went through on the wagon, but it got denied, so. If you were going to match your wagon and your. Yeah, because it would just be funny. Yeah. Slob my cob. Oh. The best one that I wish I would have thought of back in the day, because it's been taken since like the Xbox Live gamer tag came out. Uh -huh. But uh, your mom, because it's so funny. Because games are like killed by your mom. Yeah, your mom. Yeah. I feel like I, I would need to come up with one that would be really funny, though. That's pretty cool. There's two of them. Their helmets are heavy. Yeah, they got big heads. But whatever, whatever the gamer tag I do next has to be something that's hilarious. Thought about Mr. Rogers. Probably take him. Yep. We got two of them. This one, I feel like we need to display the minifigs inside of the set. Is that how you feel? I feel that way. How do you feel? Can I put Luke like he was? <laughs> <laughs> It's wrong. This has got a bunch of tons, just little itty bitty pieces in it. I'm not even sure what I'm building here. I don't remember. I think I'm just adding detail onto this floor. Because step five starts this next level. Does it make you finish the levels after? What do you mean? Like, do you finish this complete level? Before, before you start you... building the top? Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, if I remember right, it you do. Well, if we're going off of your memory, it's probably wrong. Eh, very possible. Could be right. It could be wrong. Could be. One way or another, we'll find out. Not this week. Maybe next week. Same bat place? Same bat time. Bat channel. Whatever. How do you screw that up? Bitch, I got a jackhammer. That's not a jackhammer. That's a droid chest. It could be a jackhammer. No, it's not, because the Lego actually has a jackhammer. Huh? Do they really? Oh, yeah, I guess they do. Yeah, but this is special made jackhammer. For what? And space? Space. 
then you wouldn't <laughs> need a jackhammer. The jackhammer is the Death Star. What if you want to jackhammer apart a rock? Then called you need Goldberg. a jackhammer. <laughs> you what? What'd you say? He called Goldberg. <laughs> <laughs> that was only funny because it's kind of true. Uh, I see a piece I need that I don't have. One by oh, it's right here. It's brown and not. Well, I have another one of those, so this very well could go to that because it's the only brown one I have, unless it has me add in something on top, like it did you. What is the T for? Huh? The T. What T? Oh, I don't know. I don't remember. I can't just laugh like that and not share it, Mark. It's just random. Like, so my quarantine cut that got done, that needs to be done again because she didn't go down long enough. But I texted. Uh, Christian Lineman says it's a jackhammer droid. Could be a jackhammer droid. But uh, I texted Chris and Devin and you at the same time asking if any of y'all had clippers. And he said he had just ended up. He's like, I just bought this. And he sent a screenshot of it. And he bought the uh, lawnmower razor. You know the one that's on oh, Facebook that's yeah. advertised to shave your balls? <laughs> the, the manscaper? Yeah. Well, it's called the lawnmower, for real. Yeah. And he just texted me just randomly out of nowhere. He said, man, that thing's off the law. Or that razor I bought's awesome. <laughs> it's, <laughs> it's just I had to smirk at it just because it's like a, just random as hell. How are you doing tonight, Christian? Here we are talking about shaving our balls. Right. Well, it looks like she got off anyway. They blend them too. How do you know it's a she? Because her character is an anime character. Yeah, maybe. Don't assume gender, Richard. So here's the part. Oh, what are you missing now? Where in the world did they add these in? What are you talking about? Oh, here. Okay. Oh, yeah, I know. <laughs> this, have you not, that? I, mm. I've only had that happen once so far. Oh, just wait. Or maybe I got lucky and got all the steps where it's just like, here, you need these pieces. <laughs> Is that lucky? Uh, sarcastically. Stripper pole. And I'll put an extension on top of it. <laughs> That's dangerous. That's how people get hurt <laughs> on Facebook. But not in space, it's not. How do you know? Is the Death Star so big? That's why it has gra Or does the Death Star have gravity because it's so big? That's impossible. Because in that theory... Gravity has the to exist. Would have gravity. But the, moon, but the moon does have gravity. It's tiny. The moon doesn't have gravity. What's it have? It's when you hop around in space. <laughs> Anti gravity. I wish somebody would just like comment back and like, what the hell did you just say? <laughs> <laughs> the moon does too have gravity. <laughs> no one's gonna comment against me. They're gonna comment against you. The point Nobody the has point. commented against me. That's the point of the whole YouTube channel. Hey, did uh, did you need this earlier? Yep. <laughs> really? Yeah. So the original part I had to get up for. Well, hold on. I got two. You might need them. Might need them. Oh man, I'm building some kind of contraption. What are you building? I don't know. A contraption? Kind of gear. Oh, you're building the... That's the... Compactor? Yeah. I figured. Yeah, you'll see. Thumper. Thump. 
Reaper. Oh. Supposed to be something. Ding, 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 ding. Man, if I had that part. It would be right there. But I don't. But it's still there. But it's not. Well, that's probably true. I need one more of these. What do you need? A two by two in light gray. Uh, right. You have a, you have one in the no the pack. No, there's a thick one. A little thick boy. A two by two light gray. Yep, I don't see it up here. That's a plate or a tile. Yeah, I need one. You got the box. <coughs> Or I just laid one out here, but I guess I did not. It's a good thing I bought them. Right yeah, I know. <laughs> We'd have just had to go straight hard mode. <laughs> Dump 4,000 pieces out. <laughs> God, could you imagine? How did step one end up in bag nine? <laughs> <laughs> Did you let Nicole do all this by herself? No. I like how it gives you the direction to wind it up. <laughs> what if you go the other way? That's what I was wondering. Like, does does it, like, reverse polarity? Yes. Is that how the dark, the whole Darth Vader blowing up the starship could have happened? Sure. The trash compactor reverse polarity and... Was that accounted for? Maybe. And he didn't account for the little hole in the side of the planet. It's not a planet. Yeah, kind of. No moon. It's the Star of Death. That'd be cooler than the Death Star. That's what they should have named it. The Star of Death. The Star of Death. It's the metal band <laughs> that plays on the Death Star. <laughs> What? Just because I know so many bands, I was about to say, do you know what the Republic ba band would be called? What? So there's a, a really heavy metal band uh -huh. called God Dethroned. Uh -huh. They could name it Vader Dethroned. <laughs> but they would never do that. They wouldn't because they would accept defeat immediately. Yeah. One of them cranky boys. The good old boy. What you know about that? You know something I never watched? I watched the movie. I never watched <laughs> the show. <laughs> oh, yes, I watched the movie. Uh -huh. Something must have bounced up in my undercarriage. Well, I just happened to be a mechanic. Sorry, playing that out of my head. <laughs> uh, I can tell. Oh, hey, I need this. What was it? A two by three brick. Do we have a two by two over there? Yep. I need it too. Yep, there they are. <laughs> Coming in. Lightsaber. Is there hooks over there? Yep, two of them. <laughs> I need both of those. Silenced my phone. I know. I was about to say, you need to shut that up. I know. They're not being supportive friends anyway. That's, I'm about to say that. Because <laughs> they're over here talking trash, saying I'm ghosting them. If they would jump on, they would have. Chris would have fun. Chris would have fun. I played with Chris the other night on Xbox Live. Did you? Yeah. 
because he realized that <laughs> like we were talking and he was like, I hope you know I'm not that good at this game. And I was like, that's perfectly fine. I was like, I really don't care to win. I was like, as long as people know my name at the end of it. He was like, what are you talking about? I was like, follow me. <laughs> I think the first thing I do is run to the helicopter, uh -huh. throw C4 on it, and sit back and wait for somebody to get on it. <laughs> <laughs> I used to do that to my own teammates in Battlefield. On hardcore mode. Yeah. You can uh, friendly fire. Yeah. I was like, Call of Duty, same way. I'll just wait for three or four of them to hop on the helicopter and go take off. That's fucked up. I'd get banned in, or kicked instantly. <laughs> That's when you go in one that you can't get kicked from. Uh, hardcore mode don't have that option. Really? No. Nah. How would you get kicked by killing your teammates? Is that why it would kick you? Yeah. Oh. If you if you Makes do sense. it like on purpose. Yeah. Like friendly fire is one thing. Hey, I need to. How does the game determine if you did it on purpose or not? It, it depends on how many people you kill. Oh. Like, if I'm just out there randomly yeah, cutting people down. Yeah. If somebody runs in front of you, it's not going to it's no. not gonna kick you. Yeah. If Makes I sense. blow up somebody, it's not going to kick me. But if I blow up five people at once, I'm out of the game. God, they take all the fun away. That would be so frustrating, man. <laughs> well, it, wait, you know, you respawn like every 30 seconds. Uh-huh. After, like, you know, after you die. But if you... Uh, one of the penalties is if you kill somebody by friendly fire, it takes longer for you to uh, come out. But the helicopters only spawn like once every five minutes. Like, I don't know what it is. But yeah. Hey, I need this. I'm glad we kept those pieces. Uh -huh. Told you we'd find them. Telling them they're unsupportive. Told him. <laughs> then I flicked him off. <laughs> you should have put a rattlesnake. That's what good friends do. Should have put a rattlesnake at the end of that. Well, it's all for, oh. Yeah, Come but on. they wouldn't have understood that. Chris would have. <laughs> Maybe. Things go over Chris's head sometimes. Would you rather them go under his head? Maybe. Maybe. Do, 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 do. No, oh, I can't get out. Don't go. Now that you're going to tell them to get in here and they're going to get in here, it's just going to be me. Yeah. I'm be like, wait till Mark's not here tonight. <laughs> That'd be funny. I'm waiting for it.
you know. Things come together pretty fast. I feel like. Step four, this is leaning. Because you put the cross out. I didn't say it was not where my was my fault. I just said it was leaning. <laughs> oh man. Whoa, Nelly. They text you back. Did they? I don't know what they said. Oh, they said. Probably said. I'm in bed. Exactly. You're on your phone. Who said that? Chris? Devin. Devin's always in bed. I feel like Devin would watch this more than anybody just to argue with us. Yeah, I know. It's not uh, arguing if he's always right, though, right? Sure. <laughs> you got, like, your logic. That would be your logic, though, wouldn't it? Out of that walk. What are you doing? I there? don't know. I was getting the notification away, and it's Nicole walking our dog. Not sure why. Y'all need some to do better. She's bored, man. Leave her she alone. would be dead without technology. Oh, I know. Or the dog. <laughs> the dog's like, why in the world is this woman videoing me pooping? <laughs> <laughs> Strange. So that dog knows when the phone comes out. I'm telling you, she'll be doing something just stupid as hell, and you get a phone out, and she's just like this. Just stare at you right after, like. Vader won't look at the phone. It's like, I guess he thinks she won't either. The picture. Maybe they have a sixth sense. We don't know about. Or is that the seventh sense? Because technically they already have the six. Maybe. I told Devin, I said. I said, but you, I said, but you're on your phone. I said, I have to go pick up 130 boxes of flooring tomorrow. He's like, for what? I said, floors. Oh. <laughs> She's gonna put the ceiling. Devin's the type of guy that wouldn't wouldn't help us get big. But as soon as we get big, he's like, yeah, I know those guys. <laughs> I was there since day one. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, I've known him forever. He's like my best friend. I mean, it, that's not a lie, but. <laughs> Is it? I don't know. That's for you to answer. I feel like Lego could eventually put, like, right here in small print somewhere. Like one by ten, so you don't have to sit here and try to count them. Lego could what? Put like one by ten up here, so you don't have to sit there and try to count them. Yeah, but then you got to count on there, so you got to count the Lego. Lego's not that. I've gotten to where I can look at a Lego just about and tell you what it is. Yeah. Because it's all even numbers. Right. But Technic's not. No, Technic is the opposite. It's odd numbers. Yeah. It's oddballs. Balls are odd in general. Technically, they're even. Yeah. In general. Are you sure? In general, yes. What about if you've had uh, some complications? Well, uh, you know. Let me show you something crazy. What? If you do it like this, this way. Uh huh. And then flip it around. It's a butt. It's like the mirrored thing. Yeah, no, it's the exact same size. Look, there's your stripper pole. Obi Wan's out here. Somebody come get her. She's dancing like a stripper. <laughs> now I want to see him hang from. use mo 
voters. There we go. There we go. Ah. Well, knew that was going to cancel. Here we go. Here we go. <laughs> we have too much fun sometimes. I watched a uh, video. Yeah. And it was a TikTok. But it was. figure. It was about Jerry Springer. Uh huh. And this guy married this girl. And really? He was with her for almost two years. Uh huh. Before she told her husband that she was a man. Oh, I think you showed me that. I didn't realize that was the whole setup to it, though. But that's... How do you... How? Like, how? I don't know. How? I don't know. That's why Jay Springer is so scripted. Yeah, but it's so funny to watch. It is, but there's no way that is a true story. There's zero chance. My favorite ones, though... Uh huh. Art. Oh, aren't the uh, stripper ones or anything like that? Or my favorite ones are the ones where, like, it's a really ugly guy. Uh huh. And he's with like this really big chick. Mm hmm. And then he's telling her that she's been he's been like sleeping with her mother or something like that. Those are my favorite. I'm just picturing it in my head. Especially when the mom. Used to watch the hell out of Jerry Springer. I know, that's when. Especially when the mom's like ugly and fat and the, the girlfriend's really. Well, actually, girlfriend's never gonna be pretty on there. Oh, I got a cool idea for a mop. What? You can do a Fifty Shades of Grey Dark or Red Room. No, we cannot. <laughs> Uh-oh. Uh-oh. <laughs> hell did that go? God, you got to tore down half the wall, didn't you? Well, there's no support. It's just sitting there. Yeah. This is kind of annoying to try to pop in. Is it Technics? <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> Strip her down. <laughs> the whole tower's falling apart. Here, so we don't lose that. I don't know where these went. I think those go right there. Yeah. Pink. See, now you sit over here. I don't know. It's not hooked up yet. No, this doesn't turn that. I think that's what I have is the mechanism for that. The mechanism. Mechanism. Mecca. See, I got the gear. Mecca. Mecca. <sighs> so, are you coming into work tomorrow? Negative. I think I'm going to call out. Go for it. Just because. I wonder what they would do. If you called out? Yeah. Nothing work would go on. Yeah, I know, but then I'd have to hear, that's disappointing. Would you really? I would probably hear that. Oh. I told you. I told you how to get out of work tomorrow. I know, but I, then it requires me to have to remember to fill that thing out to begin with. And then it would require you to go get tested. <laughs> <laughs> Look, paid vacation. No, it's not paid. Oh, believe me, there would be a lot. You'd be down, Andy'd be down. Yeah, because you know we can't stay away from each other. Get fussed at all the time. I don't understand why. I don't either. Like, it's so funny because they'll be like, y'all can't work together, you're not wearing masks. And then you go into Jonathan's office and Terrell's sitting on top of him. Yeah. I know. Just 
one of those things. Pick your flavor of the month. Exactly. That's the most annoying thing about the world in general. It's like, what can we talk about this week? Yeah. To scare them. Scare them to start new conversation. Start new. Release the tiger documentary. Yeah. That was still the best thing. <laughs> like, they couldn't. I know it wasn't planned. But they couldn't have done that at a better time. That literally opened up like a whole world for him. Nicole got her coffee cup, her a coffee cup that says free Joe Exotic. Did she really? Yeah. Melissa sent it to her. The, you know, um. Mowgli? Yeah. 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 She sent it to her for free. That's pretty cool. Yeah. Because Nicole bought a shirt from Melissa that said, Carol Baskins killed her husband, whacked him. <laughs> does Nicole have a TikTok? Uh, she does, but she don't do one. She hasn't done a TikTok. I mean, I haven't done one. She I does, haven't. yes, to spy on um, one of her friend's daughters. <laughs> yeah. Make sure she ain't doing nothing stupid, I guess. Going around. Yeah, because she's at that. She's she's too young to do it, but she's getting there. Like, she's about to be 13. So, you know, it's kind of where they could. Oh, where they could go wrong. That's that age, though. For what? You start doing stupid stuff. Yeah, that is the age. Start I need doing another. Stuff. Um, right here. You're about at the end of your step over there, ain't you? Close. You can't be slamming the doors. <laughs> now the T's got bigger. situation what situation if your daughter was that age would you want to know what she was doing uh, on social media you damn right you ever seen the ones like I've seen i've seen the videos where girls like sitting there twerking and the mom comes in and takes her shoe off and starts beating her while she's being there tiktok <laughs> well see here's the thing about that though tiktok is got a bunch of those yeah but my problem with that is it actually being posted to social media. Uh -huh. How many of them are staged? Oh, yeah, I know. I need a dark gray one by three. I just moved that. That was in the pile. But yeah, I don't. TikTok has, well, just the internet in general. There's a lot of stuff. That's not. Yeah. Yeah, like give me fifty give me fifty dollars and I'll or fifty likes and I'll slap an egg on my wife's head and film it. Yeah. Okay, let me try some crap like that. So Nicole did come across the TikTok that was telling dirty dirty jokes to my mom. Oh, those are hilarious. Oh my god. It was this one guy that was doing yeah, it. It's, and it's the only dad the dad sitting there, the dad makes the whole joke. Because he doesn't know what's yeah. Well no, because he bust out laughing I know like exactly just the which, I know who you're talking about. <laughs> But that is one of the ones where that dad is staged. I'm telling you, he ha is, he might he may not know the joke, but he goes above and beyond. Yes, yeah, I agree. Maybe that might just be him. I don't know, but I feel like you're I feel like you're probably right. Uh, but the the reaction he gets the the kid gets out of his mom is hilarious. Yeah. But dad, I remember watching one because she just kept scrolling through them and there was watching one. He's just dying laughing. He's like, I've never heard that one. Yeah. <laughs> I used to, what I normally do is, um, I need a one by four, uh, brick. Yeah. A one by four, what? Gray? Light gray? Dark gray? Dark gray. Dark gray, one by four, brick. 
Watching the ones that are, uh, and like I'll pull them on Haley's mom. Uh huh. Like, there's one. Let me see your hand. Oh, well, with you, I'm not gonna be able to do it. But it, you take somebody's hand and you hold it. Yeah. And you say, What does a dog make? What sound does a dog make? And they go, Wolf. Or what sound does a cat make? Wolf. I mean, meow. What sound does a cow make? Moo. What sound do you make during sex? And you squeeze their fingers together and be like, Ah! <laughs> Nineties you, or what's your favorite Mary Sue? Mine is Sue Mary. At Blazing Fingers. I don't understand that. Yeah, I'm not sure that like we just had like three random I know. uh comments. Spaced out, but the two were back to back. Not sure what you're talking about, blazing fingers <coughs> or ninety you. Oh, I get to create the monster. Yeah, and you stick him in the hole. Oh my It's nickname. If it's nicknamed that, I'm sorry. Because <laughs> that's not a good nickname. Uh, oh, what? I was about to say you're missing one, but I found it. <laughs> hey, that one by two that I was looking for. You two by two? <laughs> two by two. Yeah. I do not, however, have what? Have the pieces to make his eye. Really? Nope. What do you need? A orange, orange and brown. I probably stole your orange one. I don't know anything about the brown one, though. There's one right here. Do you got orange, too? Yep. Awesome. Sits on top of there like that. I guess. Because it can't actually attach. And then I'm supposed to add that and I don't have it. What is it? A little cheese wedge. Right here. Well, that's randomly one piece right there. <laughs> Trash compactor open. So when they come in. Finish your step. That is my step. Oh, no. Why do you got some random Technic pieces? I don't know. <laughs> this does not go to this set. What I does? Picked it up off the floor. Right. Oh. Put that in your file. I'm going to need that pretty soon, I think. You know what I'm gonna do? What are you gonna do? Sound like you're about to do something. Oh, we're doing something. What are you doing?
Mind your business. Mind your business. What was that off of? I feel like it's Will Smith saying it. It was. That's what the, I feel the, like. The, I just the, the sister. The what? The sister. The sister? Yeah. Yeah, what the sister? younger sister in uh, Fresh Prince. Oh, uh, okay. Yeah. Do I seriously already not have a piece? <laughs> I need a one by four or a two by four light gray. I got a dark gray. A bunch of two by threes right here. Speaking of which, there's your oddball pieces that aren't even. Hey, what are you making? The couch from Family Guy. It's in oh. the trash compactor. <laughs> Get the crap out of here. Man, what? Look at this. That is like almost perfect to scale couch. Look at that. His neck going to be hurting. Well. Yeah. Not my fault. Should have worked out that day. <laughs> times we had to dip into a honey pot you owe the honey pot at this point um, it'll get paid back <laughs> feel like hopefully <laughs> we're gonna be putting that mock together and be like man i need that one two by four that he took off and put in <laughs> see i'm taking a couch Why wouldn't they just move it with force? Uh, cause stormtroopers don't use the force. Oh, I saw black. I thought it was Vader at first. Excuse me. Vader ain't got time to be moving couches. That's too big. No, it's not. He's just going for a ride in there, too. Can't believe I built a couch for you and you don't appreciate it. Go on. watching this and you like Family Guy and you have seen Blue Harvest it now has a couch in the trash compactor I just keep adding to it oh, oh. oh you broke it yep. you know the guy from this angle that has the little gun cabinet or whatever that is he didn't look very happy. I know. I told you. <laughs> uh, Mark, watch this. What? See you, Vader. <laughs> Stupid. Whoa! Let's use the force right there. To let you in on something. It would be cool if we had a magnet. <laughs> Alright, so I'm missing a piece. What? A little red thing to stop this from you got one in there it 
looks cool in the video. <laughs> Push that way too far in, by the way. <laughs> I have heard that one before. <laughs> no, you haven't. Sorry. You're right. I know. Mark. Yes. Give you the balls. Make that booty clap. <laughs> Be like heated up and bent permanently. What is it? It's a little wire. Oh. Somebody's having a party. I bet you probably can't even see that. Uh, enlarge your screen since nobody's talking right now. See if you can actually see it. Yeah, you can see it. It's not the easiest thing to completely make out, but no. Oh, I hope this gets a little more sturdy. Nicole said, call me ASAP. Hey. I'm still on YouTube. What's up? You said, call me ASAP. Okay, well, we will figure it out in just a minute. Okay. Um, yeah, what... Does it say anything else? All right. Well, yeah, we'll we'll get that. Cause the rest of it, the other one, the only other thing that should be on there from uh, Best Buy is the appliances, right? And that one's on there. All right. I love you. We're on the last step we're doing tonight. Love you, bye. God almighty. It's getting wild. Yeah. That's a sausage fest, by the way. <laughs> no, it isn't. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it is.
already getting a little hype. I know. Man, this is why I shouldn't be letting half things. I know. That's why you don't need this many mini figs in one set. <laughs> Doesn't make sense, but whatever. You building the drop ship? Not sure why it comes out like that, but I'll take all my fun down. slide out this way if it does. Um, and not, that right there is the, the drink guy. Oh, hold on. This one's here. What now? That's the drink guy. Yeah. That is here. Let's say that was weird. Like, I thought it went down here. I'm like, why would it do that? It's the arc reactor. Yep, yeah, exactly. It's proof that Tony Stark has a heart. Oh. Huh. Look. I don't remember what that is. I'm, we're losing our Star Wars trivia here. Uh, it's something. I know that. Is it when they pull out the, Ooh. the fuse? Maybe. I don't know. Or was that a fuse? Somebody come get her. Um, that. And then. You ever heard of the boy yeah. from the future and the tentacle monster? No. We have the tentacle monster. <laughs> we have boys in the future. the scout. I seriously think these just do this. What? <laughs> now how does it shut? I mean that's you know that's the point of it, but yeah. like they're not attached to anything, but there is something missing in here. No, it's not. I see it. It was hiding. I didn't see those clear pieces. Hey, let me see the uh, separator you got over there. What did I say? Is there not one in that bag? But you're over there. That one. I need to get one by ones apart. I mean, one by twos apart. Oh. Out of my couch design that you. I still want to know what Blazing Fingers is. Different channel. Oh, never mind. That's the name. That is Sue Mary. That might be an anime character. Maybe. Let 
looking up who is Sue Mary. I'll be on the gun. Use this with your tactics. I'm not quite under sure I'm in your tactics. So until I figure it out, I'm gonna feel like no. What movie is that from? Do not know. What movie? Uh, Talladega Nights. Oh, okay. He's like, well, I don't understand your tactics. Yeah. yeah. So until I figure them out, I'm gonna pretend you've been there. When he's talking to uh. What's the French guy's name on there? Jean? Jean Girard. That's it. Hey, we got a problem. What? I only got one computer. No, that's in another step somewhere. <laughs> Probably in the next one. That ain't going to be in there. It's right here. Lies. All right, so we'll add that in later. Not a big deal. What you say now? Oh, that was a drawing board for the couch idea. Look, I even separated all the pieces that. Ain't that nice? I know. East, 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 baby. I'm just jerking your chain. What chain? That one. Oh, okay. That's another movie I could watch a couple times over and over. What is that? Ace Ventura. Pet Detective. Yeah, something I ain't seen in a really when long nature time. nature calls. Chicago! Like, seriously long time. Like seriously long time or just seriously a long, like time. long time. Not like seriously long time. I didn't like the first one as much as I did the second one. Really? Mm -mm. The first one with Dan Marino. Yeah. Yeah. When Nature Calls was funnier to me. Hey, hmm. you're the computers right there. Oh, it is, isn't it? Thank you. I was just helping. Good you looking out. You know testing you. And you I failed. failed. But good thing I was here. Yeah, you know. Save the day once again. Uh, all it uses these blue ones. So I'm guessing the bottom is just completely like a walk area. Like there's nothing that the nah, bottom does. I don't think so. Because this has got to be the laser. Because this turns. And with this being an armory... And with this being like this, I'm going to guess the TIE Fighter goes in the armory. Why well, wouldn't TIE Fighter go in a hangar instead of an armory? Yeah. And I don't think that's the laser. No, I'm building a gun. Oh. Well, same thing. Freaking laser. Freaking laser beams? Yeah, freaking laser beams. Did you say that Darth Vader fits inside of here? No, he doesn't. When I first opened it up, I was like, did they really make that to where you could put a minifig in it? But they didn't. I have 
proved you wrong once again, young bad one. Yeah, without his stuff on. He just doesn't have a lightsaber. Oh, really? Oh, shit. There you go. I don't think I realized the top opened when I tried to put it in there. You like that? That was my reenactment. He's going to have some sight issues. It's a little blind spot. <laughs> Can you imagine not only driving a spaceship, but driving a spaceship like this? <laughs> I feel like you would have something to give you a view. What happens, like, Where if he just crashed and then you just... I feel like somebody's out to kill him. He gets killed by his own trash compactor. Is it his fault? Yes. You know what I found out stops trash compactors? A rod. Glass. Glass? Yeah, there was glass stuck in my trash compactor and it quit working. When do you have when did you have a trash compactor? I got one now. Do you really? Yeah. It's not a common appliance anymore. Sorry, not a trash compactor. Garbage disposal. Garbage disposal. Oh, okay. Same thing. You know what I've always wanted in my house? What? A laundry chute. Really? I kinda. But I would kind of want it big enough to where I could maybe get in it. Hey, can you hand me those two shooters? Huh? Oh. Why? They're not shooting me in the neck. Let me see. Let me see. Hold on. Good God. Had a little heat on it there. That thing came out a little hot. Yeah. Speaking of uh, coming out with a little heat on it. Uh huh. You want to tell a story that happened between me and you? What? With a little heat on it? What? <laughs> I'm not sure I know what you're talking about. That time we got Nerf guns. <laughs> oh, and you popped me in my forehead? <laughs> we had like dollar store Nerf guns. And uh, I'm not sure God. if parents want kids to know this. But if you buy Nerf guns and you take them apart and you take the spring in them and stretch the spring, the Nerf gun becomes a little more powerful. <laughs> a little. And mm. I shot him from across the house in a dip from a different room and hit him so loud we all heard it left through everybody on laughing. My head. And it left a spot on his forehead. Yeah, that was funny. Give me this. I need them. I say here, I'll load them up too. Don't shoot people with them. That's what it says in the manual. I don't know. Oh. What? Your mom sent me an email. At eleven thirty. She was texting me last night at 12.15. But it's too late to go get food because it's past her exactly. bedtime. Exactly. That's what I said. I, you know. <laughs> Old people. I don't quite understand that. I'm guessing I'm supposed to see more than this. What are you trying to see? What is it? Don't want me to do nothing. The tax value and all that. Oh. Gotcha. I wonder if I have to open it up on a different... Man, don't yawn. 
That's it. Because then I ain't going. I didn't yawn. I know, but I didn't. Maybe me yawning made me yawn. Exactly. Whatever you said. Yeah, I'm usually right. Negative. I wonder if it's because she can see it because she's like signed in. Maybe. I was just trying to load them up early. Last night at 11.30, your mom said goodnight. <laughs> this is not to scale, by the way. This star's a little big. I mean, a little small. Yeah, it is. I gotta hate. Yeah. You really? That's a big gun. I don't know. Do you even need the laser with that? I don't know. The death cannon. I'm gonna go to the bathroom since she did. Go for it. It almost hurts. Maybe that's just me and my knees. far and bounced all the way back. That's awesome. I, uh, Accidentally shot one of those little bolts. It went over to the the little fabric box thing and then bounced all the way back over here. That worked. Your phone just went off again, by the way. Buying a house for us this is just weird. Why is that? No, oh, I just thought it'd be easy. Hmm? Like, Why I have would money. you think it'd be easy? I have money. You have something I want. Here's the money. Well, not that easy, is it? <laughs> nope, because somebody else is like, get that out of here. Take my money. Yeah. <laughs> I've got more than you. But you don't know that. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> exactly. <laughs> need to stop loading these things up. So you add those. I shot three. both of them. You add those three together. Oh, what? Two, what? Where? Oh, uh, I guess those two. I don't know. Value land. Was it just the bottom two? I, I don't know. You keep sticking your finger in front of it where I can't read it. Why? <laughs> hey. 
means in the past two years that house hasn't went up in value at all. That's pretty cool. I mean, so far we've built three rooms, and every single room has some kind of movement movement object. Yeah. All right. Grab the. Is there still two two bolts in there? Yeah, but leave them in there. No, they go right here. Yeah, but that's just for. I know. Eh. I know. I know you got a thousand of them, but. I gave like a handful of them to Andy. I know. Well, do you lose it? No, these two shot on the ground. I'll get them. I'm just like kicking things over like King Kong. I know. you laughing at? Spare load. Oh. Oh. What? Never mind. Okay, there. I feel like it would be hard to shoot a gun like you're sitting sideways. Yeah, but that's why you have a computer screen in front of you. True, but you just, at this time of age, you just punch in some numbers, right? Well, yeah. 45, 17, 22, fire. But Star Wars was a long time ago. In a galaxy. Far, far away. In the future. But it's a long time ago. BC. AD. What's BD? AD. Oh, what's AD? Uh, it's Latin. I can't remember exactly what it is. After death. No, that's what people think it is. It's not. BC is before Corona. Yeah. So does that mean next year is one AC after Corona? I mean, is is it really ever over now? I don't know. I hope it's over enough for me to go on my cruise. It won't be. It, don't, don't, please don't. Like, <laughs> give me a little bit of hope. You'll be fine. Uh, I'll be World, fine. Disney World's already opened back up. I know. Did, but have you read the stipulation stuff? Yeah. This, this will be. Yeah, we said no. Yeah, I don't blame you. The only thing is, is like, when do you think everything is just going to be back to normal? Like, I don't know. I really don't. Like, I wish it'd go back to normal now, but people keep popping up and dying. Well, it ain't gonna help if we keep, I guess, the population moving. Yeah. I just want all y'all sicklies to not get on my cruise ship. <laughs> Or you might want them to, and then you could just get stuck at sea for. Oh, I know. <laughs> don't tempt me for it. Don't tempt me with a good time. <laughs> as long as I'm not sick, because that would be miserable. Have you, you been know? on a cruise? Yeah. You have. Yeah, we went on for our honeymoon. Did y'all either get either one of y'all get seasick at all? Um, I kind of, I got a little seasick. Um, a, almost every night. Right as we ate dinner, because we were like third store third deck yeah and we were in the front of the ship is where the dining hall was so you would feel the movement really bad up there and then it would like i would get a little nauseous i never got sick i got a little nauseous and it would be hot down there that was i think that was part of the did you the worst uh, part but i would go get in we would get done with dinner and go get in the hot tub and i'd be great that'd be fine did your cruise ship have an adult only area up yeah. top did you yeah, it had there? cruise. Uh, that's where we go get in the hot tub every night. 
Good. It only no, got I mean, hot like, tubs. I mean, like, X-rated. No. Like, they had a, a new tannin part on the top of our no. cruise. And when I went up there, to feel the wind yeah. hit you at that fast. Oh, like, yeah, You I don't know. realize you're moving fast. No, you don't. And crane? we were, huh? Is that a crane? Yeah. <laughs> and we were, I think we were moving at like 28 knots is what we were cruising at. What's that, 60 miles an hour? No, it ain't that fast. It's like 30 miles an hour or something. Mm. Maybe it's 27 miles an hour or something like that. It's not that much different. Thirty miles an hour. Yeah. But then you put in, you know, a thirty mile an hour wind out there also. Yeah. I loved it. I was I honestly Was that your first time? That was my first time being on a cruise ship. I absolutely loved it. We would stay in the adult pool because they had a, a sixteen and up pool. So the cruise ship we went on uh-huh. had an entire like sectioned off areas, if that makes sense. Like yeah. the, the there was a normal like everybody. There was a section for eighteen and older uh pool area. Right. There was a club that was eighteen or older. Right. Then there was an adult tanning section that was eighteen or older. Like topless. Yeah. And then that was like in the front of the ship up top top. Yeah. Uh, there was a, I guess you call it a, a bar, not really a restaurant, uh-huh. but there was a bar that, uh, you had to dress formal to be in. Just in the bar? Yeah. Really? It was like a little, I mean, it was a nice area. It was big. It was about the size of our lane at work. Uh-huh. That's pretty cool. Is that for building the Death Star as it blows up? Yeah. I'll... No, it's nothing to do with that. That I think is in a. I think it's in the second story. But yeah, no, I had, I had time in my life. That was, that was probably the most fun vacation I've ever been on. And it's really definitely and it's definitely the first time I've ever been out of the country. I can't really think of like a most fun vacation. Most fun I've ever had away from here really wasn't a I guess it was a vacation. But I had some fun I had a lot of fun when I went to Arizona. Arizona. What'd you do in Arizona? Because I feel like there's nothing to do in Arizona. The girl I was dating at the time's grandmother yeah. flew to Arizona. Her co- her family lived there. Yeah. Her cousin came here, stayed a week here, and then flew back with her grandmother. Her grandmother didn't want to fly back by herself. So we flew down there to Arizona, and in the process of all making all these plans, they were like, why don't y'all just stay with us for like two weeks? Yeah. To give her more, because she was older and gave her more time with the family. Yeah. And... It was just a, like, we went down there, and her cousin was our age, so, like, she, like, let us in the hard world, I guess. Yeah. Tennessee was fun. I actually had a lot of fun when I went to Tennessee. What you do in Tennessee? I don't remember what we went up there for. Where did you go in Tennessee? Gatlinburg. Oh. I've never been to Gatlinburg. We spent... This close to it, and I've never been to Gatlinburg. We spent like a week up there. Yeah. <laughs> I actually drove the Subaru up there. Did you? The wagon. It was a... PL. <laughs> PL. Pre- pre-lowering. <laughs> oh. It was, it was completely stock when I took it up there. No. I remember being right, mad. You want to tie your string. Damn. I remember being mad about it because I had the full exhaust sitting at work, uh-huh. and I went up there and it, I didn't put the exhaust on. And there's like a a mile tunnel you have to go through. Oh man! What? Uh, I'm trying to find something to use to. Get it. Cause you gotta fish it through. Damn. 
struggle bus him. All right, here. It's got to go over and under and then down. Have fun with that. Finger's way too big for that. I just pulled that off of it. So, there's that. <laughs> that works. Oh, crap. What? That was a bad idea. What? <laughs> Since I'm laying back, I was like, oh, I'll just bring no. it to me. I pulled a mark. I'm just trying to be lazy. Gotcha. So it needs to go over and then under? Yeah. Say it again. Look. Over, then under. And then down. Yeah, and then down. Me and Haley has yet to go on a vacation together. Why? Wow. Just me and her. Why? Wow. Well, the first time we decided to do a vacation, it backfired on us. Uh huh. And we thought we were going to have like a week. We only had three days. So we decided to do like a staycation. Yeah. And we ended up spending the whole time. Like with her dad and everything else. Then Did you get that up? Oh, okay, don't go too far. Because it's got to go through this hole and back through this one. And then it just sits there like, like that. And then like my mom wanted to do some stuff. So y'all just didn't get left alone. That's why y'all gotta go somewhere. Yeah. This just sits up here? Uh, go forward one. There you go. It holds a pole still. Come to the other side of that pole. Tie a knot in the second hole, and then it clips on. Huh? Tie a knot. Oh. And then it clips on down there. Uh, and that's all that stuff is. Wow. <laughs> the pieces grew. I guess we'll just shove all these in step five. We talked about going to a cabin uh -huh. after we get married. Just as like a uh, like a me and her honeymoon type thing. Yeah. And uh, before we tried to go to Disney, and uh, oddly enough, cabins are like completely like booked. That's pretty cool. They got an elevator. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I wish this rotated. Yeah. It'd been easy to do too if they'd have done it like this. You could do it. I don't know one little piece you could put on there and make it yeah. rotate. But there we go. That's where we're stopping this week. Yeah, it was I mean it's really cool. I've yet to do something with this much movement function. Yeah. Yeah. It makes me really want to buy that haunted mansion. Especially knowing it's got an elevator in it. Oh, these are supposed to be flipped up. No, that one's down. Because Obi Wan sit. Oh. Probably a two. Gotta be the hardest damn one, too. M and R production. Ryan says nice set. Thanks, Ryan. What's up, Ryan? And uh, Adakin says hey. It's a pretty cool set. I've yet to, I've yet to build something with this much actual like function. Yeah. 
I mean, everything I've built has movement, but this is a nice set. It really is. It's a little different than sitting up there. We should put it inside the Death Star. Okay. Yeah, we'll finish. You did this wrong, by the way. What? You clicked that on the wrong way. I did that because that's why I took it back off and put it back on. Why? Wow. Because it winds down better that way. Does it really? Yeah. As opposed to, oh, because you... Because you put tension on it. No, I'm... Whatever. That's the way it was working for me. It was just working better because it had more Instead tension. Instead of... Careful, the whole thing is going to pop apart. I know. If only the knot would go to the inside, but whatever. It's not that big a deal. Yeah, it'll be all right. It's a child play thing. What movie is that from? Do you remember? Yes. What? Can't remember. God. Can't remember the name of it. I remember the movie, can't remember the name of it. How do you not remember the name of it? Because, man, I don't have the useless information in my head. If you remember the movie, then you would know it. You don't have to know the name of it. The I do remember the movie. I don't remember the name of the movie. the movie. See, you don't know or else you'd know. But I know it. That's what I'm telling you. Anyways. <laughs> we'll argue about movies next week. There's a snake in my boot. Oh, yeah, that's right. You even said that earlier know, this week. You're See? just failing me. I'm setting you up and I'm dropping knowledge for you. Like, I'm professor. I'm not sure if it's knowledge. I'm pro it's knowledge. It's just not useful knowledge. <laughs> I'm like professor and I'm giving you knowledge and then quizzing you on it to pay attention. See if you pay attention. You fail. I have a question about this. What? So with this open, you yeah. pull this open, you just fall straight down to the bottom? Yeah, that's how they escape. Or it's how they got in, I guess. They just poop out of the bottom of the Death Star? Yeah. Man, I thought they hopped in a Millennium Falcon and took off. <laughs> I know where we're putting it. Where? On top of the Falcon. <laughs> uh, that's not to scale. <laughs> oh, well. But, uh, yeah. We'll fin hopefully finish it up next week. Yeah. We got, what, five steps left? Six. We did 410, so... Yeah. One of those don't look, two of those don't look big at all though. Five is by far the biggest step, like for real. And it doesn't make sense. I don't know. Seven's pretty beefy. Which one's this one? Nine. All the odd steps. Six is halfway decent. These are all the itty bitty tiny pieces that make up, you know. I wonder if the radar dish is made the same. The, uh... That looks like it. I don't think there's... Let me see yeah, there is. See? Yeah, those. Yeah. So you make them in a line and then Yeah. Yep. We'll get to Palpatine at one point. He's in there somewhere. That'd be the first Palpatine character I have. Yeah. It's got lightning out of its fingers, too. Spirit fingers. But yeah, we'll uh, we'll be back next week. A little earlier too. I'm still uh, I'm still trying to get on Lego's website to see. I'm having a feeling I'm gonna have to wait till next Tuesday, Monday. You think First is Monday. Yeah, but you think they'll be available Monday? I don't know. I've been trying to buy a couple sets, and it's not really working out for me. But we'll try again Monday. Yeah. Hopefully, June first releases more. <laughs> yeah. I don't release know why the stock. You would secretly release something and not really secretly release, but not prepare for a full release if you are pre releasing. Does that make sense? Does this make you want to pre order the uh, Razor Crest? Yes, but I'm still going to wait. <laughs> Man. I'll order it like the week before it comes out. Yeah. <laughs> But thanks for watching. Yeah, thanks we'll for be watching. We'll back next week to finish this, and then I guess we'll have another build-off, maybe 
two or three weeks from now. So yeah, two or three weeks from now. Yeah. By then, I might be in a new house. No. <laughs> no, it's only 21 days. Oh, well, we'll be preparing to be in the new house. <laughs> yeah. I mean, I have a lot of stuff to pack up. Yeah, you do. Just down here. What are you going to do with all that? <laughs> Push it all in a box. I don't know. Some of the stuff I feel like you could. Some of it you can't. Like what? Anyways, we'll talk about that later. All those figures. they would, That's how some of them got broken, lost pieces. Oh. But thanks all for right. watching. See you next Thursday. Yeah. See ya.